third time <laughs> basically i played the song and i was like oh this sounds like that song but i was playing that song <laughs> yeah i felt like but i pressed it i feel like do you know oh it's one of the most annoying things do you know when someone in a supermarket takes something but then puts it back on the wrong shelf oh, yeah. and then you just take it because you assume that that's where the fucking cashews are because yeah. it says cashews and well, then you get home and price on it yeah i don't know I'm, I'm more worried about the fact that i've got i've now got almonds but how do you not like? Do you not read it? No, because especially right. This is a particular beef in Sainsbury's. All the nuts are in the same colour bag, right? So they're right. all in like little small orange bags that look like mini cheddars. Oh, okay. So if it says cashews, I'm just going to pick it up. I'm not going to trust mm. that it's. I'm not going to not trust Sainsbury's. Oh well, yeah, you'd... but it's some dickhead that's come in and gone. Oh, 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 put them back there with the fucking pecans. <laughs> yeah, you end up with some pecans in your hands. Yeah. Mm. Pecans. Um, Imagine your name's Pete Cans. <laughs> <laughs> Straight away, <laughs> doesn't really work. Doesn't really work. But just, met, just, just missed doing them. Yeah, I've done one for like four I, days. I've been doing them all the time. Um, so this is she make it clap, which was brought to our attention, obviously because of um, we we'll make it clap. Yeah, because of that, because we brought that. We'll it, it was clap. Aaron Wood. Oh, uh, was it? Who hit us up on Twitter? Yeah. All right, cool. Um, <laughs> uh, so yeah, this is this. So I want to see if it's as good as. We we'll make it clap. We we'll make it clap. What's a shame is that this will get cut off, won't it? Yeah, only on YouTube. Unlucky. So, she make it clap, clap, clap. She make it clap, clap, clap. It's going by a different name now, I think as well. Draco. Yeah. Now he's always Little Malfoy. Old, young Draco. Draco, soldier boy. She make it. She make it clap, clap, clap. She make it I think it's shit. Oh, yeah, it's terrible. He does his little soldier boy dance in the video, though. She make it clap, clap, clap. She make it clap, clap, clap. What do you think he's on about? Them cheeks. Batty things. <laughs> Big batty things. Episode, what yeah. was that? Episode four, <laughs> four or, something. or something? Yeah. Aww. I think any time we... Four. Four. It's about four. Yeah. Clap, clap, clap. She make it clap, clap, clap. She make it clap, it's boring, clap, isn't it? Clap, clap, Sounds a bit like a western. It's fucking clap, shit. A little western. Ooh, uh, she make it clap. Right around time with this strap on my lap. Ooh, yeah. She make it clap. He rhymed clap with lap. He's basically just took the C off. Oh, that's crap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, by the way, shout out to, uh, is it Stee? Because I mentioned episode four. Mm. And he tweeted that he... Just got on to episode just five. Just got on to episode five. So when you're hearing this, Steve, in 2028... <laughs> <laughs> Shout out you man Thanks for listening Yeah we'll be in like Studio 4 By the time uh, he listens to it We're in the studio now I know Hey, It looks the same By design yeah, but but It's well better it's it. Danny well better <laughs> um, Chilling Yeah we've got Hands free as well Fucking me. Because yeah I don't like them I think your name is Hands free Hands free <laughs> I said that yesterday Did you? Yeah Ah, Biting my style yeah. Can I Imagine jumper? if your name was Steve L Stuff. <laughs> Steve L Stuff. <laughs> or Nick That. <laughs> Rob Stuff. Mate, there's three of them. Yeah. They could be like brothers. Steve L Stuff, Nick Stuff, and Rob <laughs> Stuff, the Stuff Brothers. <laughs> stuff Brothers. Watch your stuff. The Stuff Brothers sounds like a horrible Bang a, Brothers. Yeah, yeah, the Bang Bros. <laughs> like a new one of them. Stuff, stuff Bros. Brothers. Oh no. Coming at you. It's a donut. It's a donut company, or like something like that. Stuff Brothers. Yeah, I'm making it. I'm taking it innocent. Yeah, like the smoothie. Mm. Um, which apparently aren't that innocent. Oh really? I don't think so. They did it. I think the the bad guys. <laughs> BGS. I think so. Well, uh, Google that. Get off your phone. Oh, uh, by the way, welcome <laughs> to the. Dan, Dan, you put the... uh, it's Danny and Dean. Amy's here. You're right. <laughs> Good googling, got Off. Amy on the Google. This is my Google. Amy's Jeeves. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> she's rolled ass sleeves now. She's rolled a little fleece up. It says hundred yeah. percent pure fruit. So I don't know how they're bad. No, but I mean as a company, as a company. Oh. Another way, like Coca Cola. Basically, um, they've Stuff got like, like 
small Filipino children to knit them little hats. Yeah, that they put on the bottles. Yeah, you think it's Nana's knitting them, but it's not. No, it's not. No. The name's Nana. <laughs> but <laughs> they're not old, though. How old's Nana? Nana nine. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and Dub's bars off the Mate, top. Mate, I can't do anything without talking about Dappy's dick. I know, it's just it's whopping in it. It's so big. Anyway, um, so yeah, we're in the studio. Love it's not life. finished yet, uh, but we, we thought we'd de- deprived you of yeah. uh, eyesight senses. A couple of people vision. have been getting on about the YouTube, haven't they? Didn't really realise how many people well, actually relied it. on it. Yeah. Well, they don't if you look at the views. Yeah. <laughs> Start so watching the YouTube. Start fucking more. watching it. Sub the ting. Um the subs are still going up though, even though we're not posting. Right. It's all good. Um yeah, so we've got we've got this new studio in Chester. If anyone wants to come down and watch, you can't be on. Yeah. You can't be a guest. Well, but you can come and sit in on the pod and like laugh. Laugh. Yeah. We're more than welcome. We got like we we got so much space. So much room for activities. Yeah, there? man. We dig the space. We're like Elon. <laughs> Is it Elon or Elon? Elon. Like elongated. Mm. Sweet. Is um, this what he said about going to Mars and that? What? He was like, it's not for the rich. Uh, it's for people who will most likely die <laughs> getting there. So it's like the COVID vaccine. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, he was just like, you know, it's not for the elite to just leave Earth. Like the first people that go, probably going to die. Oh, so it's like make a wish. Yeah. It's like, do you want to go to Mars and see what happens? And they go, yeah. And they go, um, all right. And then so it's you, either you that. You can't come back. And they're like, okay. Oh, okay. So it's either that or SeaWorld. Yeah. So they're like, is right. Go Mars. <laughs> Just go on Mars for the day. Well, it's not. Well, I think it takes six months to get there. Is that it? Yeah. It's like fucking trying to get around Chester and it's clockwise. Oh, mate. When I found out that road's going to be closed for 10 months, my heart sank. I fell over. <laughs> Have you found it. anything on. Yeah. So. They have kept money from the charity that oh, they started. Yeah. Who hasn't done that? No, we're not so innocent, though, is it? To earn interest. Who hasn't done a little GoFundMe and kept the fiver and put it down as petrol? These have kept... Did you do that? <laughs> I've never done Half that. a million pound, though. That's a lot. Yeah. Is it a British company? I've always wondered that, or is it... I don't know. Where's its headquarters, Amy? Let's guess. Um, Hertfordshire, I'm saying. I thought it would have been American, me. Well, California. Too Cal- obvious. Too California, easy, eh? Where people yeah. die every day over some shit they say. Yeah, those were innocent smooth days. <laughs> they were innocent, but they were. it was a red smoothie in a crip area. <laughs> London. Uh, London. I was closest with Hertfordshire. Yeah. I only I mean, said Hertfordshire because I think um, that's Slough, and that's where Mars is. Oh, Mars is British HQ. Six slog. months to get there. Yeah, so you might die on the way there as well. <laughs> I can die when I get there and realize the chocolate's not as good. Yeah, fuck yeah. modern chocolate, man. Um, he's modern chocolate, man. <laughs> shit, a superhero ever. No, he's actually a good superhero. Oh, Banana Man's the shit superhero oh, ever. Yeah. I don't know whether we've had this chat. Banana Man. Yeah. Oh, no, I've definitely. Heard, I feel like I've heard Banana Man and Banana Boy far too much on this podcast now. Who's Banana Boy? That gang. Oh, the Banana yellow. Boys. Banana yeah, they were, because yeah. there's no good colours left. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Banana Man is Eric from 28, I think it's 28 Acacia Road. And he's like a British superhero. So he was in 28 like... 28 Acacia Road. A- Acacia Road, I think that's... Can you Google that, please, Amy, where where Banana Man lives? Yeah. And um, <laughs> and have you, you've, you're aware of him? No. Oh, my God. So the whole Banana Man shtick, right? Yeah. It's like this weakling called Eric. And he eats a banana and an amazing transformation occurs. Eric becomes Banana, banana Man. Da, da, da. What's, his, what's his abilities? He's just strong in that. Oh, he's slipping over? Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> just, but he's got good ejaculation because of all the potassium yeah. he eats. Um, <laughs> is it potassium? I think it might be zinc. Does he ripen fruit faster? Yeah, well, that's it. He start in the morning, he's yellow, and then by 10 past 10, he's just brown <laughs> in the bowl. And then <laughs> the, the big baddie is like the lockdown ma who wants to make banana bread. <laughs> That's why, like, do you know they always say that you, it's bad luck to bring bananas on boats? No. Not banana boats. Cause well, yeah, anything. I was going to say. How do they get anywhere? <laughs> <laughs> well, the bananas arrived. <laughs> nah, the boat sank again. <laughs> it was just really unlucky. Yeah. 
<laughs> but because what about them smash mirrors? Same. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but the uh, bananas apparently cause other fruits to ripen faster. Yeah. So if you brought bananas onto the boat, oh, they make the pears right. It just fucks everything up. Yeah. So it's like bad luck to bring them on. That's mad. I know. Twenty nine Acacia Road, Nutty Town. Nutty Town. Yeah. And superhuman strength, flight, invulnerability. Yeah, he's invulnerable. Powers. Very much so, like to everything. Yeah, well, if you, I think he's like he must be like one of them green bananas you get from Asda that haven't yeah. ripe that take four weeks to ripe. Say, bananas bruise really easily. Though. Yeah, they're like Natasha Bedingfield, aren't they? Don't scratch the <laughs> surface. <laughs> yeah, that, I ate a I, banana. <laughs> banana. <laughs> I hate them bananas that are like uh, half crunchy. Yeah, they're too hard. Yeah, it's grim now. My Horrible. image of bananas, have you got? Because oh, we've mentioned a banana fact, right? I'm sure we have. I don't know. Yeah, we have because Peter Brush told me, and I've definitely said it on this podcast. Say it again. Bananas used to taste like the foam, the sweets. foam banana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, my favorite vision of a banana do you know when you associate things with things mm. so i always associate bananas with king louis from the jungle book yeah do you know when he squeezes them and they end, they the go in mowgli's mouth, mouth yeah. have one banana yeah do you know that's how like banana. monkeys eat bananas well i mean they don't squeeze them out but you know the way we like peel them from the store they, yeah they, they do them the, the other way, way. Oh, yeah and you always get someone every three years that puts a buzzfeed on going 10 foods that you're eating <laughs> wrong <laughs> yeah and it's always i mean bent. you're not <laughs> eating it wrong are you you you're Peeling it wrong. Yeah. You still eat it the same. You don't like put it in your ear. You're not like shoving a banana in your ear and be like banana. Um, yeah, I uh I rank bananas pretty low on the fruit index. I like a banana, but it's because they're just easy and they're usually always nice. Mm, I don't like and they're it. They're quite filling as well. I don't like many fruits that you can't eat with a knife. I know you can. Mate, do you know how powerful one feels? when? Have you ever had an apple with a little knife? That's all I ever used to do. I used Mate. to feel like the, the uh, homeless guy on Dennis the Menace. Oh, right. I always just feel like some sort of cool pirate. <laughs> yeah, I always used to do it because they get stuck in my teeth. And it's just it, better. They hit my teeth for And a purr. Days. You eat a purr with a knife. Not it's really well better. Purrs. Do you not eat purrs? No. J'adore la pear. Yeah. That means I love my dad. <laughs> 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 Which I do, I do. Um, like or I love Pete, like pineapples, me. Mm. Don't like watermelon. Oh, I love watermelon. Amy likes watermelon. She eats it out of yeah. out of the watermelon Ellen. like a with a spoon, don't you? Yeah. Oh, that's good. Yes, yeah, so it's a built-in ball in it. Oh yeah, have you ever done it like that? This morning. <laughs> no, but like the whole one. Have you ever seen them? Went cut it in half because I can't eat a full one. But have you ever seen it when someone's like took all the skin off in one and then oh, it's just a yeah. red ball? Oh, yeah. It's weird, that. Freaks me out. Get everywhere. Um, this is cool and disgusting at the same time. Go on. But have you ever... Oh, I'm going to sound horrible in front of Amy now. Shagged a watermelon. No, because <laughs> that's obvs. <laughs> um, but have you ever peeled an orange mm. without... Not that, obviously... Without breaking the skin in one go. I, I've tried. Right. I've never succeeded. I've done it. Yeah. Right. And I got the same satisfaction as when I had a poo <laughs> that touched the water before it broke <laughs> off. <laughs> and I know that's horrible. Yeah. But, um, oh, we haven't got, I was going to put that. Oh, hell no. Oh, it's gone. Oh, that's now. gone. Amongst other things. Rest uh, in peace, that one. Yeah. I do miss that one. So pineapple top fruit. Probably, it's just a bit of a ball, like. That's why, do you know what I like? And they're hard to gauge whether they're ripe or not. Pineapple fingers. Mm. But did they, they put like an extra four quid on the price because someone's done all the work for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not worth it. Pineapple that. having your fingers. <laughs> Shut up, Dad. Hey. Hey. Um, <laughs> uh, pineapple fingers or pineapple rings, they're my... Them Never had favorite. pineapple ring. Have you not? When they just no. ring them for you, just slice, just slice. Have they got loads of syrup, like syrupy stuff on them? No, no, it's just juice. It's just juice. Oh, They're fresh. I'm thinking of tinned. tinned yeah, ones. nah, ain't about that life. Ain't about that tin. Although, tin peaches taste better than peaches. As your name is Tim Peaches. I think we've. I've met. I met someone called Tim Peach. 
Yeah. There's yeah, a gig. I think it's like one of the origins of this. Tim it's called Peach. Tim Peach. It's amazing. Did he have a little fuzzy? fuzzy Shout out Tim Peach. He was just covered in syrup. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out Tim Peach. Yeah. And his mate evaporated milk. <laughs> um, Eve apparated milk. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> Imagine if your name was Eve apparated milk. Uh, that's a good one, that. Oh. Uh, shout out Rummy, our mate, who came up with, um, imagine if your name was Ike Ear. Ike Ear is funny. Some good ones. There's, there's, people throw them about on the Twitter too much. You need to save them for yeah. the competition. I did a, a shit one that I like. You know, you do one that you know is like not levels, but you're mm. like, uh, imagine if your name was Pat, me dog. <laughs> <laughs> Pat, my dog. Uh, Lucy Goosey. Was, uh, oh. like. Imagine <laughs> your name was Lucy Goosey. <laughs> Oh, uh, uh, do you know, just just dead quick while Amy's here and I can embarrass her a bit. Oh, no. Just, you know that Scatman, R.I.P. Yeah, she didn't get it. Well, I showed her it written down. Rip. And she was like, rip, rip a dee ba bip a doo rip a dee doo ah, rip a dee What does that mean? And I went, Sc- Scatman. Yeah, but <laughs> did it have the dots? No, I'd already told her, though, uh, right. about the, the original joke. But then I was just pissing myself at the... Because <laughs> our mate Stuggy wrote it down but didn't put the dots in, so yeah. it looked like rip. Yeah, it didn't that. look right. So that's fine. I'm, I'm with you there, Amy. Yeah. Well, was, you got to do the dots. It's funny to me. Got to do the maths <laughs> and do the dots. What have you been up to? Uh, been working. Doing Tattoo this as well. Uh, we're setting up this bad boy. Bad boy thing. Uh, tattooing. Tattooed Tyler. Oh, mate, my head fell off. Little shout shout out, out Tyler, man. Yeah, What's no. his surname again? Do we need to... No, I don't want to bait him out. don't want to bait him out in case people... Look him up. Look him up and say, show us your sick tat. We did retweet it, but... I don't think... I know his name. I've yeah. remembered it, yeah. but I don't think it's... Uh, imagine if your name is Tyler the Roof. <laughs> um, <laughs> or Ruth Tyler. Ruth we might Tyler. have done Ruth Tyler. Yeah, quite I think like it, it seems, seems um, familiar. Yeah, it seems quite old, like basic one. Mm. That Like we're above that now. Yeah, we got, we got like... Levels to them it's now. Dwayne, eh? Dwayne Pipe's still my Dwayne favorite. Pipe's though. amazing. It's such a good one, that. Um. So, um, how big was it? Um, wasn't massive. Probably about like the sticker four size. Four inches, yeah, something like that. Is that four inches? I don't know. Seven in it, that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it was cool, man. It was good to meet him. He's a nice lad. Good guy, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You've nearly met him twice. Oh yeah, because I've been to his house. That that was weird. I've been to his house twice to drop off merch because it's on the it's sort of on the way from mine. But so, I've never met him. So I've been like, Dean, can you just throw this through Tyler's letterbox? Because Dean's sound, he's like, yeah, he's right. But it stressed me out because it was like, oh, his house is twenty two, and he pulled up, and it was just like a, a car park and all the houses, and I was like. I'm just going to put it through a letterbox and hope it's his. <laughs> it was. I found the number two. It was. Yeah, yeah. It was his. I've just found the number 22 and was like, this is going to have to do. Because he didn't answer the door. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> do you know how much they cost me then, T-shirts? I would have paid you back for <laughs> it. <laughs> All right, then, yeah, sound. Um, was he, what, that, so basically, if you don't know, Tyler, uh, one of our patrons, one of the big dogs with, with the tattoo, um, it wasn't for that. No, I know. Oh, okay. But you get one. It's yeah, well, It's yeah. well worth signing up if you like tattoos. Mm. But he's had the logo, our logo, the chameleon, which is, I mean, it's a sick logo. Yeah. It's arguably the best logo I've ever seen. Yeah, Nike def- what? Defo. Nike's just a tick, isn't it? It's good, though. It's, it's a swoosh. Yeah, a tick, though, isn't it? No, because it's, it's Nike, isn't it? The yeah. goddess of victory. What's, it, but what's that got to do with it? She swooshes about. Just swooshes. Goddessly. Swooshing about going, I win. Yeah, just right. do it. Yeah. Which is like what they say to the little Singaporean kids who <laughs> stitch their shoes up. <laughs> it is though. That's that's literally. Yeah. Just do it. It's, it's it? up in the sweatshop. Yeah. Just fucking do it. Swoosh, Nana. Or swoosh you. Swoosh you up. Mm. Um, 
So he had the logo tattooed on his actual flesh. Yeah. So what he doesn't know is there's only two episodes of this podcast left. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> About to start being dead racist. We might just change the name and the logo. <laughs> oh, yeah, if we start doing like... Just horrible, just horrible fucking comedy. Holocaust denial. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then he's there forever I'm associated. Here. We call... Hey, by, by the way, do you know that that chameleon's called Hitler? And we just draw a little Hitler tash on the fucking thing. Well, if you look close enough, I did do a little Hitler tash on his one. <laughs> and that's, he's forever associated with that. Hitler oh my boy. god! Yeah, we won't. Shit, Don't worry. you've got that power though as a tattoo. Like, if someone came in that you know you didn't like, yeah. and but he didn't know why you didn't like him. Mm. So say like, well, he, this like, has happened in the news. Oh, has it? Yeah. What your news? Well, in, in the tattoo world. Right. Did you ever see that? I, I don't subscribe to uh, Tattoo.com magazine. Tattoo Weekly. Yeah. <laughs> you don't see it then. <laughs> you don't see it. Because it's weekly. Yeah, done. you have to <laughs> tattoo strongly, don't you? You have to really put the ink in the epidermis. Yeah. <laughs> Is that right? I think so. I don't know. You should fucking know. I just do it. They stay in. That's all I need to know. Do you have to do like a tattoo license? No. That's you get, mad. You get... Um, I really need a... An extension on these headphones. Yeah, headphones. yeah. Yeah. Can you pull this a little bit? Look at coming a cord, yeah. A cord. Um Sprite there. I'm sipping on purple drank, but without the Sprite. without the uh what is it, codeine. The um the council come and check the shop. I don't like this. Why? Because it's like I'm getting you know when you like do something wrong in a cartoon and your mum pulls you by the ear? Just bend the headphones. I, I can't know. I like the sound of my own voice, that's why I do this. <laughs> um So the council come, check the shop. Right. It's like clean. Up hygienically and you've got hot and cold running. Have you got like a five star rating like a kebab shop? I, I, I don't think so. No. It's I say like a kebab like, shop, not most kebab shops around Chester. <laughs> it's more just like reviews from people. And Tyler left me a five star as well. He's nice right. Um, Wait till he sees that Hitler time. <laughs> <laughs> there'll be, one, there'll now, be no. one star of David. <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, there we go. That sounds better. Settle down. I just don't. I, in my head, that wire was longer. I thought it was eight seasons. <laughs> I feel like it was like. Instead of five. No, but this table's lower than the old table. Um, so it's a little, it's a couple of inches. Damn. Damn, um, Daniel. <laughs> but, yeah, so the council will come in and just check the studio, but they don't know if you can or can't tattoo. There's no, That's, like... So I could just, your mad. boss could employ me? Yeah, yeah. And I'd just be there like that. You get All a right? certificate with your name on going, yeah, I'm... I'm legally allowed to tattoo in this premises. Imagine if your name is legally allowed. <laughs> to tattoo in this yeah. premises. <laughs> legally blonde. <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, it's mad. That's why there's so many tattoo shops. I think if you had to go through like an actual... Legal like a driver license. teens want it. <laughs> <laughs> your dad's porn search, that. <laughs> uh, should get this, they need to scrap that, I think. What? Teen categories. What if you're 20? You're not a teen though, are you? What if you're 19 and you want to watch porn of girls your own age? Oh, go and have a bevy outside. And... No, I know, but like, <laughs> do you know what I'm trying to say though? Like, if you're 19 and you want to watch some porn, but okay. you don't just want to, like, no, if, right, I'm, I've never said this before. No offence to MILFs. <laughs> <laughs> no offence to all the MILFs out there. But if I, when I was 19, I went, in, I went into MILFs like that. Yeah, but like, what's the difference between 19 and a 20-year-old? A year. Yeah. Do the math. Like you don't thing. have to call it teens anymore. Mm. I think it's just a, it's a weird, it's a weird but line. But teens, teens doesn't mean teens in now, I don't think, in porn. It means like... But the whole word's just... I just feel like it shouldn't be there. What, it, teen? Just teen. Oh, how, do you know I was site. gutted when I, I watched Teen Wolf? <laughs> and he wasn't like, oh my fucking God. <laughs> oh my fucking God. <laughs> oh. oh shit, I wonder, I'm fucking with the light maybe. I've just oh, done an eclipse. Right. By the way, this one's the first one we filmed in here, so it probably yeah, will change. I mean, it will look better. I will have... Um, I'm going to get that extra inches I've always wanted and yeah. I'm going to get a, a headphone... Um, imagine your name is Headphone Jack. Um, <laughs> I'm going to get a... Ed. I'm going to get a Jack lengthener. Headphone Jack. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, 
that I want to. We won't do it now, but I want to read because it's weird. We're gonna. I don't want to bait you out Go and on. talk about like porn viewing habits, right? So we'll do that when when Amy's not here. Okay. But I want to watch not porn together, <laughs> but I want to like because I'm obsessed. I've never really read them, but I have a little bit. Yeah. But I'm obsessed why you're allowed to leave comments on porn. Yeah, yeah. And who's like, I don't know what your views are. <laughs> Probably low. <laughs> no, but um, I don't think I've ever watched porn longer than like. You need to. 90 seconds yeah. or something. Never look. But it's not even how, how long you want to watch it for. It's watching it and going, I'm going to write something about that. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I don't get it on YouTube videos, never mind, on porn Yeah, videos. yeah, yeah. So it's like, but I reckon there's some absolute... Oh, there'll be some ridiculous comments on there. Like we could... I don't, I don't, Amy probably doesn't want it on her laptop. Do you want to Google some? No, we'll have to do it. All right, okay. Yeah. For, just go, just open comments. any random porn. Turn the sound down. <laughs> oh my fucking God, that's Team Wolf. <laughs> um, <laughs> what a fucking slam dunk. Um... <laughs> Oh, you're so hairy. <laughs> um, and we'll. Uh, by the way, you know what? You know what always gets me oh. in porn. So natural. Like if it's not natural, you're fucking a like a robot. But what does natural mean? Basically, no surgery and and normally like a bush. Ah, uh, okay. So talking about that, not like big naturals, mate. They sound like a band. Do you know, like, <laughs> the Big Naturals? Yeah. <laughs> it's a Big Naturals like concert. A country, like a country <laughs> band. Yeah. Uh, but, like, do you know the way, say, like, you go, oh, uh, like a real woman. Yeah. And they're always, like, I may not just, be like, a lady. curvy. Yeah. It's like, I don't get that. What? Why? Some of us have boy bodies. <laughs> <laughs> all right. But like, yeah. oh, Some of us are <laughs> angular. <laughs> we haven't all got curves. But why, why is that make you a real woman? Oh, I'm a real woman. I know. How would you feel on that one? I like that you're here so we can talk about it. In this. my head, a real woman in porn, though, isn't necessarily curvy. It's just that there's no surgery. Mm. So I think you could still be like, have a, your words, boy body, and yeah, still be like, classed as a real woman. Like fake boobs yeah. or whatever. I get you. Have you got any, um, any comments? There's just so many... <laughs> so many dicks Penises. in your face. <laughs> what am I meant to be doing? Just press on a random Click one. On a video, yeah. Let us know the title. So yeah, I tell you what, read some titles out. Okay, this we'll one pick is a title. Waking up, she found a cock in her mouth. <laughs> no, I don't like them. <laughs> powerful facial. They shouldn't be that powerful facial. Sounds like something from Body Shop. It sounds like a yeah. <laughs> or like a real like a heavy metal band. <laughs> um, I've, yeah, I've noticed that they're creeping in the old. Uh, it's like a bit, a bit date too, rape, Yeah, it's it? horrible. Like, ooh, she was sleeping and like I woke her up with this dick. It's like, all right, chill out. Come I only watch amateur. <laughs> I only watch amateur me. Yeah. Don't watch anything where there's like an industry because I don't agree with the porn industry. Do you feel like it's it, the, the real ones are like fake? Sometimes. Fake, whereas the amateur yeah. ones are like, oh, they're, like they're actually It's done on a 3210. Yeah. <laughs> I'm having it. <laughs> Little Nokia one. What's some more? Uh, need to be reading stuff out here because. It's just, they're just like. Read them. It's fine. Okay. Sexy slut. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds better with your that accent one. as well. You want me to click on that yeah. one? Yeah. In the comments. By the way, what, what site are you on? Pornhub. Classic. I don't use it. No. What do you I use? use like a jog one. What's it called? Jag one? X, X N X X or something? Why? Because it looks looks less bang on in your uh, no in your browser. No, no, no. Oh. I just that's the one I always used to use. I don't really yeah. bother now. No. But um, have you? Oh, here's a question. Have you ever like watched porn on your phone? Yeah. And then like just gone off it. Yeah, it's still been on your phone. Yeah, and then you go and try and show someone something on the internet <laughs> no. and fucking powerful facial comes up. Team Wolf. <laughs> no, but I can imagine it's a very awkward thing. Yeah, but there comes a point now where you just have to be like... Yeah, watch porn on my yeah, phone. Watch yeah. porn on my phone. Do you want to watch it? A little four-inch <laughs> Read wank, this comment. Which sounds worse than it is. Someone just put hot. 
And then they put thanks. Is that it? Yeah. On that one. But even that's a bit weird though, isn't it? Going, I thought this is hot. Just the, just the, to have the proclivity to do that is weird. Is there a likes and dislikes button on there? Yeah. Is there? Yeah. It's, it's, like, it's essentially that. YouTube, isn't it? But it's just well, it's called you porn. Just dirty. There's less tubes, dirty but there's videos. more tubes. <laughs> <laughs> Someone's commented, I walk to Burger King, then I walk back home from Burger King. Brilliant. See, what are you doing there? Why are you doing that on a porn hub website? I think this is a good feature, but we might have to like prep it. Yeah. Let's do that. Okay. Let's um let's do some foreplay on it first. <laughs> yeah, we'll come Warm back to up. this. Yeah. We've just gone in dry here. Yeah, yeah. And it's awkward for everyone. It's, yeah, not ideal. So I want to go back to this because we went to get into it once and we and we ended up cutting it out. The yeah. people them don't know that. But yeah. sometimes we cut stuff out. Uh yeah. So it was basically I was I, I had this thought about um Where did the thought come from? Marijuana. Right. I was more thinking about like Oh, imagine if you how much weed I've smoked in my life. Oh, okay. How big the pile would be. And then I was like, I wonder how much ale I've drank as well. And oh, like, do you know what I wonder? How many I... times I've uh, waved back at someone who wasn't really waving at me. Oh, horrible. <laughs> Such a horrible feeling, that. <laughs> you go, oh, oh, oh. That might be the worst one. The amount of times I've pretended that I'm going to sweep my hair back behind my ears. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't even got hair like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's horrible. Yeah. Um, or when you think someone's waving at you. What's... Yeah, that's what I mean. Oh, right. So you they go like that because they're waving at someone behind you and you go, eh? and then you go, oh, oh no. no. I was thinking of... Do you I know wasn't when, waving. It, when you see someone you know and you go... And, and and it's not them. No, but they don't see you doing it. Uh, so that's you have to like, be like... Oh. What's worse, that or the, like, the leave me hanging? That's a bad one, isn't it, when you go... That's worse than like, than the handshake one, because at least I've done it once, and then <laughs> I was dead pass at pass ag about it. Yeah. So I went to do the handshake, right, and he just left me. So I went, oh, I don't want the fish. And I just <laughs> pretended to swim <laughs> the fish in back in my pocket. <laughs> good one, oh, that. like that is it? <laughs> oh, sound yeah. Yeah, I'll swim off. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that. That's you, horrible, I suppose that. you could do that with the fist pump, but like jellyfish it back. Yeah. Just, or just drop the rock. Oh. Can't drop the rock. Oh, you can't stop the rock. Can't stop. Can't stop. Who was that? The rock. Uh, all I can think of is can't stop. Won't well, stop the beat. No, that's oh. that's awful. <laughs> Apollo four four zero. Apollo four forty. Four four zero. <laughs> Apollo four four zero. Yeah, we've essentially got a nan doing the googling. <laughs> like. It's handy to have, but there's gonna be there's gonna be times when it's like, what are you talking about? <laughs> so um so, oh. <laughs> look it up. <laughs> look it up. <laughs> Amy can't hear that because yeah, she hasn't got headphones on, but you know, when it goes, oh nah nah, that's what that's what we did there. No, we nah. did that before as well when we were talking about bananas. I can hear it a bit. All oh, oh, right, okay. safe. Change your hearing aids up. <laughs> <laughs> your loop. Put your loop up. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I was thinking about loop up, loop up. I um was sort of seeing a girl back in the day, like oh yeah. five, and we'd been seeing each other. Like not even so, we were just like there was nothing a fish or anything. Mm. We did it was it was we didn't no one dated then. Yeah, so we just sort of used to hang out and then seeing each other, sort of yeah, and we smooched. Mm. And this is about like the third week of seeing her. Yeah, and she. I think she'd not long been broke up from someone like six months ago or something. Yeah. So she was obviously used to telling someone that she loved him. Right. As soon as they finished kissing. Because that's what you... Yeah, yeah. So she like kissed me in a car, in a Clio, and then just went, um, I love you. And I was like, what? <laughs> she was like, oh, this sucks. Not the response No, but I was like, oh, I know what, I was dead sound with it. Yeah. And I was like, I know we're just sat here in a little black Cleo down a river. Mm. And I know it's romantic and that, but you didn't mean that, did you? Because you just used, to, that was like a muscle memory. Like a reflex thing, yeah. And like, I've never seen someone go so red. And I was like, it's cool. Yeah, it's Like, fine. I don't think you're weird. It was, it, that was good of you, though, in, instead of going, what, fucking hell. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm don't sound go like, away. That, like yeah. And she was fit, so I wasn't going to try and, <laughs> gonna try and ruin that. Amy's quite a queen of awkward, aren't you? Yeah. 
remember the uh, the lift doors was funny. I don't know if that was awkward, but it was it was funny. It was just me and some girl was like waiting right at the door, and when the doors opened, we just screamed in each other's faces because we wasn't expecting each other. Oh, like either side of the door. Yeah. She was waiting to come out. So it was we like the, like a in. weird take me out like a mirror. scenario. Because they were like the same height as well. So <laughs> the doors opened and they were both like face to face and both just went. <laughs> oh, mate, I was in, I was a uh, big flex. I was in the Louvre. Yeah. And there was, have you you've been? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So do you know the bit that's like done out like Louis the Fourteenth's bedroom or whoever it is? It's like pink and that. It's like up, so. it's like the top floor. It's done out like his his bedroom would have been. Right. But it's like in the Louvre, there's loads of like cleaning stuff and that that are just built into the walls that you don't even see. Mm. And I was just walking along looking at the X, the exhibit, <laughs> and uh, the f- fucking wall opened and some cleaner come out. And I just went, <laughs> <laughs> in the middle of La Louvre, like a right fucking donut. Uh, it's funny, and then man. I instantly voted Brexit because of that. I was like, I never want to come here again. <laughs> Uh, I posed on a on a marble plinth in the Louvre, didn't I? Mm-hmm. Louvre. How do you say it? The Louvre. Louvre. I don't know. It's spelt like that, isn't it? Yeah. But yeah, there was like a marble plinth with no statue on, so I went and got on it. Posed on it like a statue. Yeah. Just put a leaf on your dick. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Amy, chisel me dick off. <laughs> Did you enjoy the Louvre? Yeah. Massive though. Yeah. It's like grand. sixteen tre, kilometers. Tre <laughs> What's your favourite? Um, I like the Jesus, the one with the Jesus merch. Did you see that painting? No. Nah. It was like Jesus carrying a cross, and there was a woman holding like a little bit of merch. Oh, selling the merch. Face on. Yeah. His boss. Not seeing outside the gig, outside the Jesus gig. Yeah, yeah. It was amazing. I was probably like, there's no one else onto this little merch here. Can we find what that is? Merch there. Um, Have a look for Jesus merch. <laughs> <laughs> in the Louvre. Be like... <laughs> Just I what, imagine it's Mary Magdalene. Maybe. Um, I like the seeing the Venus de Milo. Yeah. Just because of the Simpsons, though. Oh, oh I found it. Because of the gummy de Milo. Oh, I don't know what that is. It's like a he goes to a candy convention, and there's like this Venus gummy de Milo. Yeah. And uh, he robs it. And then finds it. It's stuck to his car, and he's dropping a babysitter off. Oh, and he touches her ass. He gets the gummy. Oh, and I, she thinks she's Yeah, I'm, I'm aware he's a pig. of... He is a pig. When really, though. he just wanted to. No, but he is. But he is a pig. Yeah, a bit he's of a, a pig. horrible pig. Ah, oh, no, I love him. Um, Good guy. <laughs> I like the Caravaggio in there. Yeah, uh, I like it. He's my favorite mm. painter from that um, era. He had a heavy life, didn't he? Did it? I don't know. Was it you? Tell me about Caravaggio, Amy. Oh yeah, he was like. Hey, look at the range on this pod. Like mm. we've gone from King Alfred last week, fucking it's Caravaggio this week. <laughs> yeah, and then like teens. That's Caravaggio, isn't it? It's a, no, this is um, weird. West Side Gun. It's a, it's Vir, you know designers Virgil Abloh. But it is a Caravaggio yeah, like painting, isn't it? It's yeah. um, David and yeah, but I know like he didn't have a, a fucking Benny the Butcher pendant. <laughs> yeah, there. Yeah. I know that bit wasn't. It's on David it. and Goliath. Yeah. But yeah, it's Virgin Ab- Virgil Abloh from Off White oh, and Louis Vuitton cool, who's designed it. It's an album cover. Yeah, what was the thing about uh, Caravaggio? Hold on, let, let's give Amy one job at a time. Yeah. We asked for the merch Soz. the merch one. It's annoying because all I can find of it is people sharing the picture being like, oh, merch Jesus day. merch. Oh, look at you, you're hack. hack I shared that hack picture pamphlet. myself. there. Oh, hey. Fuck you now. What was the second thing? I want you to tell us what you know about Caravaggio. Because you told me some stuff about him the other day. Do you reckon he got the piss taken out of him because he's got the word Vag in his name? <laughs> <laughs> it's not. It wasn't his real name, I don't think. Was it? Michelangelo. Is his name. Oh, yeah, it's already taken, isn't it? Mm, so he's like, uh, don't want him getting all the, all the credit for my work. Do you think Caravaggio would have been a better turtle? Probably. Who who'd you get rid of? Yeah. Um, I know who you. Fi- I think Donatello. Yeah, because I don't. I'm least familiar with his work. Yeah, like I couldn't tell you what he's done. What he's done. No. Like in my head, the turtle's more famous than him. Yeah, I mean, I didn't even know. I was like, oh, it's uh, Leonardo, blah blah blah, but I didn't realize all of them were named after. Yeah. Artists. Raphael. Who's that? 
He's the the where pre Raphaelite comes from. He's like oh, really? he's done some things. I thought it was a uh, Rafa Benitez. No, <laughs> <laughs> or Raphael that used to play right back for United. <laughs> um, and uh, Michelangelo, obviously, yeah, he painted the sixteenth chapel. Oh. <laughs> Took a picture of that when we weren't allowed to. <sighs> Rebel. Yeah. Uh, all his family died of the plague. Oh yeah, classic. Oh, he's sad, isn't he? So he become an apprentice or something, didn't he? At Airbus. Yeah. Loads of my <laughs> mates became an apprentice at Airbus. At age 11, he Whoa. relocated to Milan and began an apprenticeship. 11? Mm. So where's he from? Italy. <laughs> nice one. <laughs> so he went. He moved from Italy to Milan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> big, big move, that. Probably didn't need Pickfords for that. <laughs> Damaged all his pictures. Yeah. Um, I. What's your favourite museum? Um, do you what do you prefer, the Louvre or the the one with the Sixteenth Chapel in it? And I know I'm Saint Paul's Basilica. Yeah, that's not, that wasn't really like a. It sort a of music. is though. Well, that then. Do you like that? That, one? that was incredible. Yeah, because incredible. Yeah, because I thought it was amazing, and then I found out it was all mosaic. Like, it, imagine it, if your name was Mosaic. <laughs> Um, when I found that out, I was like, oh my God, Like it's even more impressive. You say, oh my God, in there, he answers you. He's like, what? <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> that's, where, that's where he lives, isn't it? It's open the door. Hello. Like, <laughs> but yeah, that, uh, there. the Sistine Chapel, and that was incredible, yeah. Yeah, I thought it was fine. Yeah, just fine. Do you know what? When I went to Roma... He went, he went blind from all the paint in his eyes or something, didn't he? <laughs> yeah, he did. Did he? yeah. 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 Because he's lying on his back painting. Well, yeah, I'm aware, but... It's all dripping in his eyes. Do you know it? what's mad? Is like, these are meant to be the most clever people ever. Like, he's like an amazing artist and he's like... She's a role model. It's like when you see, like, someone who's a genius builder, but he, he fucking got kicked out of school at 13 yeah. and, like, got run over because he looked the wrong way when he crossed <laughs> the road. Yeah, he'll, like, he's an amazing builder. It's weird skills. Yeah. Just put a, just put a paintbrush on, on Like, a isn't stick. it weird how you can, like, be dead good at something but can't spell yeah you know like learn like you, you things that i think of, yeah in a certain way yeah it's so odd mm. like when you like because in my head you need like a base level a good level of, i've played football at an all right level just like county level yeah and i always thought that you need <clears> to be like a base level of intelligence but then just to live well, no, just to play football because oh, right, there's a yeah, lot yeah. of thinking involved, like put, put the like positional sense and stuff like that. Yeah, and you see some of these footballers and they're thick as fuck, and you're like, <laughs> whoa! Like, there's one. He's called Jason McAteer. I don't know if you know about him. He's a Liverpool player from like the '90s. He yeah. was one of the Spice Boys. He was he was cla someone said that he's the only person that couldn't spell pop backwards. <laughs> That's how thick he is. So someone went, what's pop spelled backwards? And he was like, oh. Yeah, like, I don't know whether, it's, <laughs> I think it's just a phrase. Oh, okay. It's not literally. He's, no, he's that thick that he couldn't spell pop backwards. Yeah. Um, when, <laughs> there's a story about him when he, he was watching the snooker and someone got a maximum break, mm. which is... 147. Yeah, and when it, the black ball went in, he stood up and went, 180! <laughs> <laughs> you're like, that's darts, bro. <laughs> Fucking dick splat. Um, is that so? What museums have you been? Um, the Louvre. La Louvre. Van Gogh. Van Gogh. Yeah. Did we go to the Rembrandt Museum? No. I'm, I'm sure we did, but Amy thinks we never, so. Ripley's Believe um, It or Not Museum. Oh, yeah. That was a good one. That's the best. One. I went when I was there. The Broad. Broad. The, the person I went with was like, Are you going to be at the Rembrandt Museum? Mm. And I was like, I'll be there for you. <laughs> <laughs> we'll make it they, imagine if they replaced that we'll in Friends. <laughs> so no one told you life was gonna be this way. We'll make it clap. <laughs> we'll make it clap. Do you think it's four or five claps in the Friends One, thing? two, three, four. Yeah. Some people think it's three. One, two, three. No. Someone was saying it was five. No. I know it's definitely four. What, like. one for each member? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now, um, it's de yeah, it's definitely four. Yeah, who's Jason? Who's told you that? Jason McAteer. <laughs> <laughs> he told you it was no, four. I heard it on the on the radio. They were they were all clapping like, 
And I was like, no, that's one too many. Stop it. <laughs> like, Mate, you know what you're talking about? Like dancing in the moonlight and that mm. one it wonders. Yeah. So the Rembrandt's, I'll be there for you is on 134 million streams, like nearly 135 million. Yeah. And um, let me guess what the next one, what's the name of the next one? Just the way it is, baby. This. 4,000. Ah, oh, sounds like when Ross and Rachel made them. No, it's 15 million. Okay. Still quite a lot. But then the next one, number three, is the Friends theme. And then number four is I'll Be There For You TV. But So out of their five popular streams on YouTube, they've got 16 million for other songs and like nearly 150 million for I'll Be There For You. Two, three, four, another, five. Yeah, yeah. That's carrying over to the next next bar. There. Don't want that. Is this the same? same? No, not as the TV one. This is the. T- the, the vocals sound different. That's that. TV one is all I know. If I hear it's anything all anyone else, knows. If I hear, hear the other one, I'm like, nah, this is someone covering the, the Friends tune. This. No one went to the fuck the, the Rembrandts and gone, hey, they don't sound like this. Do you think, how many times do you think they played that live? I think they've only ever played that live. Yeah. I don't think anyone wants to hear anything else on the Rembrandts. Mm. If you, I mean, if you went and they just didn't play. Like, I love a museum. J'adore a musée. I like a natural history museum. Mate, I've got beef. Why? So I've been to, well, I've been to the Rembrandt, liked it. Mm. Uh, been to the Van Goghy. Mm-hmm. I went with a uh, fellow comedian and podcaster, Dan Nightingale, to Amsterdam. Oh, yeah. And we're both boring cunts. <laughs> <laughs> like, we don't really, like, we weren't there for prostitutes or weed. Yeah. We just wanted to, like, have a beer. And Amsterdam's not a great place to go if you just want to have a yeah, beer and like a dance. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So we went when we should have went somewhere like fucking Spain Bruges. or so. Like, well, yeah, maybe. Well, no, but like, so we went to Amsterdam and we were like some sort of middle-aged old gay couple. <laughs> so we were just walking around the park together. We went to the zoo. Mm. Uh, and Amsterdam we went. Zoo is quite good, mate. It's the best. It's Britain's. It's Britain's best zoo. <laughs> Uh, no, Britain's best is Chester, but Amsterdam is the only one that I've been yeah. where I've been like, and that's only because the wolves, the wolves, Scott Wolves, yeah, the gladiator, yeah, he's there. He's just the Michael there. Uh, Van. Oh, what's his name? Michael Van Winkle or something like that. It is Van Winkle. It's Van. It's Defo Van. It's Defo Van. There's isn't Defo a Van in there. Is it not Wolfenstein? No, there's Wolf. Uh, there's no utter- utterance of Wolf in his real name. Michael Van Wyke. Wike. Mm. <laughs> um, so, yeah, we just walked, we just did all like touristy type stuff. Yeah, mm. In, but that's not. We were like, I think we were both still in our twenties at the time. Really? Yeah. Yeah, and we just. We had half a brownie. We shared a brownie. Yeah. So we went to like a cafe. Did you feed each other and they, the brownie? No, no, no. But they were like, um, <laughs> yeah, like, can we have one brownie, two spoons? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like when you don't yeah. want a pudding at the Toby. <laughs> you don't want a full fucking eaten mess. Yeah. Um, and we had like Arthur. Imagine if your name is Arthur Brownie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think Arthur's like a cheat code. Arthur and Juan. Yeah. Um, what was it? Polly. Polly's all right. You can You can go a bit. Yeah. Out there with Polly. Huh? What, like Polly, Polly Cystic Ovary? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good double barreled. Cystic Ovary? Yeah, Cystic <laughs> Ovary. Polly Cystic Ovary. Um, <laughs> so, Polly Unsaturates. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we, we shared a brownie and like laughed for 10 minutes. And that's the, the only time I've ever done any weeds. Done the weeds. The weed thing. That's the thing with, with Amsterdam. Like, I feel like just all the touristy stuff there is to do is just so much better doing it high. 
Right. Because it's it's if you don't get high there, it's a bit of a boring place. Ma, I like it. It's nice to walk around and that. But we, we went not to a that sex show to do, together. Though, yeah, we go to one of them high. It's hilarious. Oh no, it was so bad. We got scared when when we went, didn't we? And, I mentioned it on Have a Word, but like, because we were both comics, we just went there. You probably heard it. Like, oh, that's weird. And um, set up. We were just looking at the room going, yeah. fucking cracking. Yeah, gig. Yeah. If he takes his dick out of her, <laughs> mate, and does some fucking gags, <laughs> this would be a better gig. We went to a little. If she hits his dick and said, is this on? <laughs> <laughs> we went to a, an open mic comedy in Amsterdam, didn't we? Oh. And it was Toomla. Oh, it was just. I don't know. Was bit, it in a hotel? Off, no, no. Oh, right, okay. It was like one street off the red light district, so around them, mm. them ways. And we went in, and it was li- like we left because it was that bad. That was like us, but in the sex show, we left. We left before the money shot. Well, there was a guy on stage, clearly, like, can't have been doing comedy for very long because he looked at, like, at, now I know they were Indian because they said they were Indian, but he looked at them and he went, anyone in from India? And just pointed at him. Well, he was like, is anyone in from India? You guys will be. And it was like, well, yeah, because everyone else is white. (laughs) Yeah, but also, like, there's loads of, like, subcontinental Asian countries. Yeah, he could have said from Asia. But it was was weird just to ask. He could have went, where are you guys from? You just don't point at them because, (laughs) believe it or not, I know loads of British people that are brown. Yeah. So they could have easily been yeah, yeah. from Amsterdam. Mm. But he could have just went, where are you Oh, mate, from? watching bad so comedy. He was like, he was like Any, anyone in from India? Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I'm really fun. Oh, we're getting off here. Anyone in India? <laughs> I mean, like, India. <laughs> are you in there or are you out there? <laughs> just trying to get out of it like that. Yeah. It was bad. E. But yeah, the sex shows are weird. What happened on you on your one? Do you remember? He was just flipped. Like the guy was like, he looked like. Was this. there not a few there? Like we went, we weren't in there long. Right. Once we realised that the, there was no comedy on, yeah, yeah, yeah. we jibble obble, yeah. chocolate bobble, jibble obble <laughs> out. Um, we we went in, we looked round, looked at the setup. Yeah, <sighs> great. No, nice in here. Good yeah. sight lines. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then like the guy was like Mathis. Like swole man thing. It was like kind of like a mini theater. Like yeah, a tiny tiny theater. But it was bigger than a tiny theater. It was like a theater. It was like, like a, in the middle and then all around. And it was like outside. a re- revolving the bed in the middle on the stage. Oh, no, it was like an actual theater. It wasn't. Oh, okay. there was no air uh, around the sides. No, oh, it right, was so like right. a stage. It yeah. reminded me of um, the one in Port Sunlight a bit. I've done. Don't know. So it's on a revolving bed, but the guy was massive. He looked mm. like, uh, have you seen Spartacus, the series? Yeah. He looked like Barker. I don't know which one that is. The one who's like gay. Right, okay. Like, he's like right-hand man for a little bit. Yeah. Um, He looked like that. And the girl was like small though. <laughs> and I was like, oh, is it going to be that? And he's like, <laughs> but I think it, she was small because he was like throwing her around and that. Not fuck it, but he was like picking her up and that, yeah, yeah. and that was part of it. It was more gymnastics, like acrobatics. Yeah, something. it was more like that. Like, yeah, oh yeah, look, yeah. I can spin around and all this. Yeah. And it was like, mate, what's what the fuck is this? We were like, oh, should we go? And uh, we jibbed it and just walked around. Amsterdam is my favourite city to just walk around. Yeah, I think. yeah it's cool because it's not that big. Mm. So the only thing is, that it's scary when you're high because uh, the pavement, the road, the bike lanes are all the same colour. And, and there's a canal. And yeah. there's a canal. And they're coming at you from the opposite I don't know if you direction saw the canal. as well. So you look out and you go, "Oh, there's nothing coming." And then you go, mm. <laughs> "I nearly got run over in Rome because I looked the wrong way." Yeah, oh, Rome. Rome's nice, isn't it? But when I went to a sex show, one of the things I can remember what, from it was uh, a woman put a, sh- a sharpie up her vagina. Yeah, and then squatted and wrote her name on some guy's chest. Oh, that's cool. I think you missed that bit. Do you know what's mad, though? Because I'd be like, ah, I can't get that off. It's permanent. <laughs> yeah, they were doing white blood. Yeah, because you're not, yeah. <laughs> Do you not get a fucking statler? <laughs> yeah, oh. I didn't think Do you not use the... chalk? Yeah. <laughs> I could have just dusted it off. <laughs> oh. Um, oh, that's weird. Tri- vagina tricks. Mm. 
I mean, do what you can with what you want, yeah. but I'm not one for vagina tricks. Like, what tricks are there? There's loads. Like, there's a woman who's made a career out of it. All I know is... Are you Googling vagina tricks? Yeah. Wow. That's what she's here for. Sticky Vicky or whatever her name is. What does she do? Pop ping pong balls out? Yeah, and like pull pulls things out of it, like razor blades and that. Razor blades? Yeah. What do you mean it razor blades? <laughs> um, <laughs> or Mike 3. Uh, uh, that's yeah, like thing, stuff like that. And I'm always like... Oh. And I find it very sexist because I've never seen a man doing bum tricks. <laughs> oh, my God. No, but you know what I mean, though? I know what you mean, yeah. It's always like, why don't you get someone in to lighten the load on Sticky Vic, get the man in? Well, Sticky Rick. Sticky Ricky, yeah. yeah. Get him in. <laughs> Sticky Nicky. Just popping ping pong balls off his bum hole. They'll fire quicker, I think. They'll be like oh, the... Little stinky ping pong balls. <laughs> <laughs> no, but the velocity on them is going to be more, I think. Yeah, probably. So what's your favourite museum? <laughs> <laughs> Sex music. Oh, I didn't go to that. It's weird. It's, it's not even like, and, and really, it's just more about like old, like sex toys. And I think sex wise, we've evolved. It's like once we've evolved past a certain way, I don't want to see what we used to do. It's mm. like we've got plates now, so I don't want my food on a wooden board. Yeah, it's yeah, very yeah. much like that with sex. Yeah, it's like old, old sex toys and shit. What with like bees in? Hang <laughs> bees? In? Oh, buzzing. I don't think any of them. I think that's. I don't know whether. That I've heard that as like a false, just, but apparently like there's like a dildo that used to be. Do you know when you get like extra studs with your football boots? They're in like a tube <laughs> with a screw on top. Like you know what I mean? Yeah. They're in like a vial. Mm. A fight? Is it a vial or a file? A file. It's spelled file. Isn't it's it? like a test tube yeah. with a screw on the end. Yeah. And apparently that it's like it was like that, and you put bees in it, and then screwed it, it away, and they buzzed away, and you put it in. Wonder if that's where Love Honey got the name. <laughs> <laughs> we'll make it club. We'll make it club. Uh, was like, I'm sure there was like fucking a, a winch. Yeah, but like a machine though. Oh, like, like a. Like I've seen some of them now. That yeah, you wouldn't. Now they're just electric in it. Yeah. They're battery like operated. A two man job back in the day. Oh no! Imagine that. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing now? The fuckle brothers. <laughs> <laughs> You've had that in your head. I honestly, oh, I haven't. Mate, that was too good. Honestly, I haven't. The fuck up, brothers, mate. I'm getting better at this stuff. Mm. <laughs> what, uh, what funny tricks can you do? They can, not me, but. No, I mean, how do you know? In Don't general. doubt yourself. Yeah. I, I, I <laughs> believe I can laugh. <laughs> fuck the patriarchy. <laughs> <laughs> whistle. Whistle. Whistle with the. With a whistle. Oh, or just mate. On its own. So. Mate, is there a better way to fuck the patriarchy? Than getting catcalled off a building site and then whistling back. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, Imagine though, is... wolf whistle and then whoop, muff whistle straight back. <laughs> like, but was that a kettle? You'd be like, <laughs> <laughs> but do, do you mean that's with what a I'd whistle? do? I'd yeah. be in the kitchen just so doing it. So it's, oh. it doesn't just whistle on its own. Yeah, you put a whistle in and expel air out, and then. Yeah, it's oh, hard like, to find video evidence. I don't want the video. No, so I don't like. want it. Well, not now, but send what? me the link, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what else is there? Blowing up balloons and opening bottles. Oh, blowing up a balloon. Mate, I feel weird when I see someone opening a bottle with their teeth. I can't imagine <laughs> how I'd feel <laughs> if someone was like, hey, have you got... Oh, oh I've left yeah. me lighter. Hold on, give it here. <laughs> And then, what, and then what'd you do with the... Thanks, I guess. Just spit it back out? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Where just hold I'm, it up and walk to the bin? Where they're all just I'm waddle going. to the bin? Yeah, like the uh, after-sex waddle to the top. Oh, I, I hate that. <laughs> the, the idea of that. But, yeah, just just drop it. Yeah, right oh, into no. the recycling. Eee, you got it in the wrong one. Squat and get it out. <laughs> uh, what else? Is that it? Yeah. Three tricks. And ping pong, the classic. Oh, yeah, that's classic a classic that. one, that. What about, surely could, someone could do bubbles. Oh, yeah. Anything expelling air. Mm. Blow out birthday candles. Yeah. You'd get expelled if you tried it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In sixth form. Upper sixth, I will add. <laughs> yes, please. <laughs> I'll add that. <laughs> what could you do then? You could put... <laughs> <laughs> fucking free blind mice on the recorder. <laughs> 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 oh, I can't do that but I can do forever chapter. or like tin to, woo, yeah, you know yeah, this little yeah, tin amazing. whistle <laughs> oh and then the, the upper class women with the clarinets yeah <laughs> that low bow and that 
<laughs> you are a fucking hobo if that's your party <laughs> trick. Oh no. What else do you do for blowing out stuff? It's like blow football you could play. Mm. <laughs> Uh, yeah, uh, that is what comes out. Uh, yeah, <laughs> there we go. We're done on that now. So, what's your favourite museum? <sighs> I, th- I liked, I liked the the Louvre. The Louvre was good, and I did like the br- the is it the Broad or the Broad? The Broad, Broad, Broad. Some, In LA, some sort of gangster. Did you go there? No, you went to LA? no, no, no. It had all the. Uh, it had some. What was his name? Jeff Coons. Yeah, that like the big. What's his name? <laughs> <laughs> like the big uh, porcelain inflatable dogs. Oh, right. them. Mm-hmm. They were cool. And uh, what the fucking... Oh, like Warhol and Barbara Kruger. And, and the, the pop art guy. Ray Lichtenstein. Lichtenstein. Yeah, yeah. All them. Well, I went to the, cool. the... My favourite's the MoMA in New York. Oh, you'd have to do with your... Um, thing you that, didn't you? It's fire there. Is it, yeah? Yeah, it's Never great. been to New York, though, so... Sorry. And I felt like a bit shit because when I went, they had a Banksy exhibition and I was like, oh. Come all this way to see a Banksy. Been, yeah, it's like when I... Well, town. do you know what's mad? I've been to New York thrice and I've only ever seen British or Irish celebrities. Really? Yeah. Apart from when I saw Cameron in the Pink Range. <laughs> he drove past in the Pink Range. That's fine. Huh? 2002. I saw Joss Stone. Yeah. Yeah. And we like stopped her for a picture. Me, mm. Wizard, and Danny, RIP there, Danny and Wizard. We stopped her. There's a picture somewhere, but like on like an actual photograph yeah. of me, Wizard, Danny, and Joss Stone. That's and it was just when she'd released it, like she was still, well, obviously. Popping off. Like if Joss Stone. She's been on American Idol this season, hasn't she? Joss oh, Stone? right. Well, if she walked past me in the street now, I wouldn't know who she was. No. Um, I saw Colin Montgomery. He was a golfer, Scottish oh, yeah, yeah, golfer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And last time I went, I saw Col Meany. Don't know who that is. You you do. Col Meany. Colm. Colm. If, you, if Amy Googles Col Meany, C O L M, Meany as in, why have you done that? That's not nice. <laughs> and then show Dean. Oh, he's a. Yeah. He's like him. a really famous a- actor, Irish actor. He's always like a gangster. Yeah, he's in he's in layer cake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's sick. Seeing him just bouncing around. Just in the here. street though. No way. It's but mad. that's weird. I've never seen anyone famous from New York. Yeah. Who's from New York though? Uh Jerry Seinfeld. Yeah. But he's left now, so you won't see him there. Has he? I'm sure he lives like in the Hamptons or something. <laughs> still upstate New York, yeah. isn't it? It's still New York State. Um, I'm surprised we didn't see many celebrities in LA. Yeah, I too big. Where we I hang. thought I'd seen Johnny Knoxville. Right. But I didn't know whether it was a Johnny Knoxville impersonator or not. That's the so thing that's the with problem LA, with LA, it? yeah? Because mm. people get pictures on that. Johnny Knoxville. But Nox- the way he Johnny was walking, Knoxville. I feel like if he was an impersonator, he look, He kind of looked like he had his head down, you know, like just mm. trying to get down the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. As an impersonator, he'd probably be like, hey, get, look, yeah. welcome to Jackass. Hold on. Like, you know when he walked off? Mm. Did he like walk into a lamppost or anything? <laughs> brown. Did he? <laughs> no, no. Wasn't him then. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, he didn't have like pins sticking out of his head or nothing like that. Um, didn't you hate the people who used to swear that Dirty Sanchez was better than Jackass? Um, I don't really think I knew anyone that said that. I knew loads of but people it just being like, no, Can't. just being contrarian. Yeah. Like, oh, it's actually better. They probably voted to to leave. Yeah, props. It was. I mean, don't get me wrong. It was an all right show it in its good, own yeah. right, but it yeah, was no. It was no Jacass. No, definitely not. Jacass was so good yeah. when Jacass came out. A new one's coming out in it. Bam's not like not allowed on it or something. Why? I don't know. It's been beef, I think. Oh, like that. Mm. Oh, not. It isn't like. It wasn't like Jackass One, Jackass Three, and Jackass Me Too. No, <laughs> no, no, I don't think so. Okay, <laughs> you never know these days. Fucking, I can't oh, watch yeah. Kiddlehood now. I know because of that nasty fuck. No. Bad times there, mate. It's so nasty. I haven't, I haven't listened to it or, or read up on it. But I, the one thing I did read that I, I just stopped me reading anymore mm. was the fact that he he tried to get people to do naked auditions. Oh, is that what all the naked auditions? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff I, was well, about. I assume so because it, it. I just seen a lot of people going, "Oh, 
naked exi- uh, naked auditions don't exist, blah, blah, blah. So, But then I seen the Noel Clark thing. Mate. But I thought what I read about that was just the... In like, fact, we should probably just check that just for clarity. Can you... If it was him, if you put Noel Clark naked auditions, yeah. not naked attraction, um, that's fire. <laughs> I, uh, I just seen he like was accused of like bullying and sexual harassment of like over 20, 20 He's women. He's a fucking egg though. I know, man. And I, I used to like boss films. I used to rate well. him. And do you he's know what's mad? Shit out of me in that film as well. Oh, when he's like, I'll push you up, fucking man, it, boss it? you up, clear, you fucking prick. Mm. But that's real though. That's what's mad. Yeah. Is when he's on about smashing that fucking girl's head in yeah. who's in sixth form. He's probably like, Not even that was acting, easy was just, acting yeah, for him. Yeah, yeah. Um, Documentary style. Uh, yeah, so you know all the stuff about Adam Deacon? So you know they fell at him. At, you know Adam Deacon, the, the lad who's in. Yeah. Kid so that, he yeah. was like, he used to say for ages that he was a bad guy and he was like a bully and stuff and like that. And everyone thought, oh, he's sound. And then Adam Deacon ended up going in like, f- getting mental health issues and going in like getting because like, no one believed him. Yeah, having to get like help that. and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And now all this has come out. And yeah, like, so everyone's like, oh, so. So I think our next watch along maybe should be another hood. Yeah. Which is Adam Deacon's like. The follow-up Fried. One, it? Well, it's not a follow-up. It's like a. It's like the scary movie to Kiddlehood. Is it? To Kiddlehood Scream. It's like a pastiche of all those. Like It's like Don't Be a Menace. It's not meant to be like a, it's a, tr- like, like it's, a parody, though, is it? Yeah, I thought it was so, like a proper sequel. No. Oh, no. That's There's Kiddlehood, Adulthood, and Brotherhood. Oh, and sorry. And then there's another hood, which is like a joke that. one with Richard Blackwood in. Right, I haven't seen that one. We'll, we'll watch that. Yeah, I've met sounds. Richard Blackwood. Have you, yeah? Yeah. At Hot Water. Oh, yeah, my mate was at that gig. But you know what was I told mad? my mate that John, uh, John Richardson was meant to be on. Oh, right, yeah, he when was. He pulled out. Yeah, he jibbed it. And my mate went just for that, and I texted him while he was sat in the audience going, lad, he's, he's bailed, you know? <laughs> he was like, fuck off, fuming. <laughs> but um, did you... Um, so there's allegations by 20 women, but of nothing's... Not on about yeah, naked sure. auditions. But was it him that was trying to do the naked audition? I think it him must have... and... Right, okay, yeah. So we're not... Else. I just don't okay. want to speak about something so serious, like, because it's, it's all... I mean, it's obvious that you 20 is a lot. Yeah, yeah. But just for the podcast sake, you have to say allegedly at the mm. minute. But... Yeah, and it and over. Two's bad, isn't it? Even well, one's, one's bad. bad. Yeah, yeah. And he's bad. But when it's 20, though... It's like, yeah, but what I mean is, like, I feel like a dickhead here going allegedly because mm. it sounds like i'm not believing victims yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. like but when you've that. got this that goes out i've got to say it's that but like if, if you want to ask my real opinion yeah. in the street where i'm not going to get done i'll tell you that he probably did <laughs> yeah, yeah um so uh yeah well maybe that's the, for for adam deacon mm. we'll watch another hood yeah, and we'll yeah, fuck yeah. kid up we're not going to watch it anyway but like, because Noel Clark was so pissed off about um, rest in piss, kiddlehood. Yeah. <laughs> was he? Was he just an actor in that, or was is he? No, he wrote. I think it was his, his oh, thing really, and yeah. everything. Yeah. Ah, fuck him. He's done. He's on the R. I call it the R. Kelly list. Yeah. It's a p- fucking long list now. No, but it? that no the R. Ke- the R. Kelly list is. It's not like all the wrong uns. Right. It's all the wrong uns who I previously, if they weren't a wrong un, I would still enjoy their work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right. So, um, R. Kelly, Tory Lanes, mm. who shot Megan the Stallion in East the Stallion. foot, in the hoof. <laughs> uh, <laughs> she followed the first or something. <laughs> What's mad is that, yeah, that's what it was. He thought she was injured. <laughs> he just tried to... He was like, why won't this screen go up in the Rolls Royce? <laughs> Didn't they shoot each other? I don't know. Or something was... Like, there was a mad altercation there, wasn't there? But Findus were on the phone going, hey, do you want to buy her a <laughs> sticker in a lasagna? Meg the... Lasagna. No, no, it doesn't work. work. Lasallion. Yeah, yeah, try <laughs> this. <laughs> so, Go take some shots mate, off, you? R.I.P. Bob yeah, Bob yeah, yeah. seems like a long way away after Meg and the lasagna. Even fuck the brothers. Lasallion. That's what the fucker brothers sing. <laughs> fuck me, fuck you. Um, <laughs> uh, where were we? We went on a mad one. What's your favourite museum? <laughs> oh yeah, what is the? Well, at least we've got an episode name. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mine's the <laughs> MoMA or uh, the Grosvenor Museum, Chester. Oh yeah, no. Is it a good one? no it's <laughs> only when I'm doing a gig there. The gigs there that we did. Oh, a fa- right. Did you ever do one? No, no. Oh, you'll have to do the next one. Yeah. The, like improv gigs, they're fire. Oh, I heard about them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah They're yeah. really good. We'll do another one soon. Do they have to be like on 
a certain subject? No, 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 no. We just show things that are in the museum. Yeah. And you have to pretend you know what it is. Oh, uh, and do like a sort of TED talk. Yeah, about so it's basically no like, about. Um, yeah, it's like, it feels like it's a forfeit from Impractical Jokers. Oh, uh, okay. Ooh, it's good. sounds horrible. Yeah, it's good. <laughs> it's, yeah, but it's, ma- it's mad how you but feel after doing it. You yeah. feel like you've just like done the Apollo. Yeah, yeah. Even though you've just done a gig to like 30 owl fellas but in do, the museum. Do people bomb hard at that though? You can't bomb hard because I go on and say like, I'm there with you as well. Yeah, yeah. I really, really ram it home how hard it is. Yeah, right. So they sort of like let you off. People have died. Yeah, but but not but the crowd aren't like yeah, yeah, off. Yeah, 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 right. yeah. It's not that vibe. Oh, that sounds fun then. Um, yeah, it's a weird one. Ooh, by the way, we mentioned the studio and that we got. I just want to shout out John Charles for that. Oh, um, yeah. Can you see that on the shot? Maybe. It's uh, Jordan 1, it's class. Uh, we've got the no-score draws. We were, uh, that's what they're called. They used to be called Panini Cheapskates that draw, but that's the PES Some edition. Of them are terrifying. Yeah, I know. But they do, if you go on their, their Twitter, they're like, oh, sorry about this one. And that. <laughs> uh, Outcast. Got the Stan Chow, Kareem Abdul Jabbar, and uh, Wu Tang up there. And uh, the, the para, you can't see the Piet Para uh, postcards that I've made into a little. What's that? What have I made that into? Monta- a little collage. A little collage. Um, by the way, Para are releasing a, another Para dunk, mm. which you won't be able to get. Yeah, and I just want pricks to know that I was like, I'm a fan of Para before, before it gets all big. you little hype beasts get on the dunk yeah. wave. Fucking knobs. Uh, what was I gonna say then? Oh yeah, the Sean Paul wall. Oh, the Sean the, wall for the big dogs. Yeah, we'll be sorting that out. That'll be up where? soon. He's over there in oh, the shadows. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's in the, in the dark, and he needs <laughs> he needs to give someone give him the light. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> <sighs> I feel like Sheesh. I feel like we haven't it done any drops. Yeah, it's high, it's high. Yeah. Um, the <laughs> it's all good. Appreciate y'all though. <laughs> so, what's your favorite museum? I'm gonna I'm gonna just go for the Louvre. Right, Amy. Uh I enjoyed a lot of them. But Ripley's Believe It or Not museum. Oh, that is such a weird was one, though. The most fun. Oh, there was some. Mad but is stuff that a there, museum, though? though? Yeah, yeah. Or is that? That's there's a bit the of the Berlin Wall in there. Oh right. There was shrunken heads. What? And you have to believe whether it's the Berlin Wall or not. <laughs> yeah. Because it's probably <laughs> fucking next door but ones. <laughs> yeah. But that is all... a weird one. There is sometimes you have got to be really trusting in the museum. Mm. Like not like back in the day when the, you know like the thing with relics. Yeah. Like every church has had like apparently there's been like over eighteen Jesus foreskins. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Where you've just got to go. Okay, he's a priest. He wouldn't yeah, lie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> speaking, <laughs> speaking the words. Of the yeah, big yeah, man, yeah. Like, so. Yeah, there is a bit of that where if they go, yeah, this is definitely the Berlin Wall, I'd be like, uh, this is, is it all? Because it looks like a wall. Might just be a bit of wall from Berlin. Exactly. Might not be the Berlin yeah. Wall. Yeah, our Berlin Wall. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but they had, like, the Last Supper painted on the wings of a dragonfly. Yeah, that was all mad real. shit like that. That's not fair on the dragonfly, that. Yeah. It must be hard with flapping about all the time as well. Yeah, but imagine it? if, like, you woke up and fucking there was, like, a Banksy on your arm. I mean, or like the, the dragonfly was definitely dead. Oh, I thought he was just there, and they were like, "Hold on, <laughs> no, you never see it, would you? Just hold on, there. He might have been a cooperative dragonfly. <laughs> what works with the co-op? <laughs> <laughs> um, what else is there then that that sounds a good? Massive belt buckle collection, like from all over the world. This sounds absolutely. You do you need to be shit. real high to be in there? I think being high in there helps. Imagine if, like, you've been abused as a kid and then you go in and there's the belt book, the belt book, if you've had, like, yeah. parents that used to beat you and then you go in and there's the fucking belt book, buckle collection. <laughs> oh, shit. What's next? Oh, the sticks. <laughs> um, what else is there? There's I'm interested A, a now. giant, uh, not bumblebee, like an insect or, from Transformers. Oh, yeah. Like, I thought, like, I think it was, like, to scale or something in there as well. Oh, they sound shit, though. What's yours? Have you already said the Mo- I like the MoMA. Oh, yeah. But I also like um, the the one in London. And I, I like the National Portrait Gallery. That's nice. Is that a museum? Is a gallery a museum? Yeah. Yeah. I like the Van Gogh. Yeah. And and I did like the Rem- I like the Rijks Museum. Mm. And the, the modern art one in Amsterdam is really good as well. Have you been to that? I went to that with Phil Chapman. Shout out Scooby. 
Uh, I don't know if we went to that one. The, we went to a, a Mucha exhibition in the Walker Art Gallery. Oh, it was right. a good uh, one. Yeah. Mm. But Ripley's is like just Mucha. more fun. Yeah, but is that there's one of them in London, right? I didn't think they were museums. I thought they were like... The Walker one? No, the Ripley's. There's one in like near Leicester Square and a Trocadero, I yeah, think. Yeah, yeah. But I think they're all filled with like like world record shit. See, you know I mean? in my head, that's as much of a museum as Madame Two Swords. I get what you mean. It is more of like a But a, then an what is a museum? Can you Google the actual definition of museum? But I think being because being I've high just, is what made it. Right. Because I've just said the waxwork museum and is museum just a pla- a building yeah. where there's stuff? Because I said Madame Tussauds, and I was like, oh, but that's a waxwork museum, so maybe a museum is just a collection of things. It's a building in which objects of historical, scientific, artistic, or cultural interest are stored and exhibited. So anything can yeah, be yeah. a museum, really. Is this a museum if people come this and look at it? This is a fire museum. Yeah. It's a museum of fire. <laughs> Le Musée de Fuego, <laughs> even though that's two languages. <laughs> Bilingual pods. <laughs> um... So, I was going to ask something and I forgot, so it's cool. Yeah? Yeah. Cool. Oh, this is <laughs> this is my issue with Ripley's Believe It or Not. Yeah, you don't there believe needs, it. There needs to be a not. So, there does need to be some stuff in there. That they go, I oh, know, actually, this is a blog. Yeah. yeah that, so, you yeah. go in and you go, is that Berlin Wall? And they're like, no, nah, it's Sandra's that. Yeah. Sandra's Wall. So, it should just be called Ripley's Believe It. Better yeah, believe it. yeah, you better believe it. <laughs> Ripley's true, but does it not a mean true like, museum? Believe it or not, what, a true museum, a true museum. Ripley's true museum, yeah. but does it not mean like believe it or not? It's still it is true. Yeah, I get it. Whether you believe it or but not, but I like the idea of do you believe it or not? And I go, you go no, and they go correct it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real. That's what they should do. <laughs> yeah. Like, would I lie to you? Like, maybe you go they around? do. We just didn't know. And we were going around thinking everything was real. You go in and you go, oh, that bumblebee from Transformers is to scale. And they yeah. go, ah, oh, no, actually, it's 1.1. 1. 1. Oh, believe that. I believe, I believe that, that then. Hello, this is Danny McLaughlin from the Damn Daniel podcast. And uh, I'm here just to remind you that we do an extra episode a week on Patreon. We're on Patreon. That is like a subscription service where you can sign up, pay us a little bit of money a month uh, and get rewards back. You don't do it for the rewards mainly. You do it to support us, right? You keep this podcast going. Uh, we've all <laughs> we've, we've got no work on this is our work so um so yeah if you love the podcast keep subscribing to the patreon uh we've got loads of stuff on there you can subscribe to as little as three pound a month it goes up more obviously and the more you pay the more you get there's loads of cool rewards on there like uh, an extra episode a month you get a full extra episode a week sorry not a month a you get a full extra episode a week for little as three quid for an extra couple of quid you get like early access you get to watch this shit so you get to see how many times per podcast I move position quite a lot, doing a lot. 23 positions in a one night podcast. <laughs> and then it goes up for the more money you get, like some personalized shit, some little poems and some drawings and shit like that. Uh, it's well worth it. Discount on merch, discount on live shows. They're soon come now. Apparently we've had the go ahead. So that might happen sooner than you think. So please go on patreon.com forward slash damn Daniel podcast and, uh, and support us. That's, that's what we want really. If you, if you like it, we've worked out that the lowest tier is works out at 75 pence a week, which is cheap. And then for more, it's like a, a shit coffee. And then it's like a shit coffee with a shit syrup. And then it's like the higher tiers is just like buying us all a beer a month. That's it. You'd do that. Wouldn't you? If you saw us in a boozer, buy us a bag of crips. So, um, so that's it. That's it. I'm not very good at these adverts, but we had to do one. So please support our podcast if you like it. If not, that's cool. Keep liking, keep subscribing, keep sharing, but mainly subscribe to the Patreon. (laughs) We're back. I say we're back. They won't know, but we've had a little break. Yeah. I got a beer. So did I. All the the Amsterdam chat. I put mine in a beaker. Tracy. I only drink in, in Tracy's now, in Teal Tracy. <laughs> <laughs> a little teal one as well. The damn Dan, can they they can't see that on the camera, but No, but it's nice, nice little Shall I show, I feel like I should show them. Show out for them. Yeah. It's a bit more mint green, I think, than teal. I'd say that was teal just for argument's sake. Okay. You'd be wrong, but That's not <laughs> mint green. That's blue. Sea foam green. Cyan. Look, see, 
This is more teal. That's I'd say that this is still blue, though. It's still on the blue side of aquamarine. Nah, no, that's seafoam green. Nah. It is. You need to see yourself Anyone out of this. Home, Google seafoam green, and that's that colour cup. I'm going to edit the podcast. Seafoam? So that's, so that's dead green. What seas are you... Yeah, just like... A, <laughs> so green that you could put, like, New York on it, like yeah. it's a green screen. <laughs> yeah. There you go. That's that colour, that. Mm, I don't know. So uh, I'm hey, going to say one of my least favourite things. Do you know when people say, um, <laughs> let's agree to disagree? <laughs> yeah. What does that even mean? Let's just both it shut means up we and move think, on. Yeah, it means <laughs> yeah. we both think we were right. Yeah, yeah. Agree to disagree. Ag- agree to disagree. You have to say it in that voice in as well, because that's voice. like a cunt voice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like mine was more like a Damo, Damo Larkin voice. Oh, right. Shout out Damo, nice him. guy. Good guy. Nice, good, nice guy. Um... <laughs> He sent James uh, some voice notes once that were like, hilarious. Yeah. Get James to play. I won't bait him out on mm. here. But one of them. When James eventually comes back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he, I won't say in the context, but Larkin uh, references his own dick yeah. as the Larkinio trunction. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Do you know he's on Cameo? Well, why aren't we on Cameo if, if these people are on Cameo? Damo's on Cameo. By the way, I'm t- talking about... He, he's a mate. He's been on the circuit a long time. He's he's a very funny man. Uh, he's a te- He was a terrible comedian, <laughs> but still a funny man. Does he still do comedy? No. He, he, well, he compares his own gigs, which is oh. fine, isn't it? There's a few that do that that aren't, aren't the best for it, but it's their yeah. gigs or whatever. Um, But yeah, he's quite a funny man, but he's not... I've got a... <laughs> Mate, there's a story. I can't say it. Why not? No, because it's not. It's weird, and I don't know if it's hundred percent true. But I'll tell you after the pod, (laughs) Sounds. and you'll laugh a lot. Okay, (laughs) laugh a lot. Records say laugh a lot. Um. Oh, I wanted to talk about me being old, right? Okay. But now I'm gutted because I basically I, I don't agree with slippers I just wear my shoes in the house or my socks like right so if I'm in the kitchen I'll keep my shoes on mm. and then if I go in the front room I'll just have my socks on I don't and no then sliders I've got sliders but I don't think that they're a slider is an outdoor wear I, I wear sliders as a slipper right Amy put sliders on to walk from bed to the bathroom <laughs> right what ki- what type of sliders like plastic sliders Levi's. like rubber sliders yeah, yeah. I, don't, I think furry sliders like the ones that you get in like hotels and that they're more of an indoor shoe right yeah and when I say shoe I'm spelling it S-H-E-W by the way not S-C-H-E-H no no no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Um that annoyed me when that shop first popped up Shoe. Yeah, and people were saying shoo. And you're Who like, was saying shoo? Loads of people didn't know how to say it. <laughs> and you're like, what does it sell? Yeah. Shoes. Sh-ca-hoos. Maybe that's how, yeah. <laughs> Shkahuba diving. Maybe that's how you yeah. say it, bro. Shkuba equi- equipment. Shkuba Steve. Um, if you ever said shoo, swill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I love how swill yourself is like, hey, do you hear about Dave? Swilled himself. Because <laughs> you can't say that without someone going, do you actually mean he killed himself? Yeah. <laughs> like, no, he just splashed uh, his... Just, just what, he just had a wash, wash yeah. in the morning? <laughs> That's what my granddad used to call a wash. Have a swill. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, my dad said that as I'll well. have I a think. swill. I've, I've sure I've heard that before. Yeah. I'll just have a... You go in a pub, granddad? Quick yeah, swill. I'll just have a swill. Quick swill and a pint. Swill young. <laughs> um, yeah, but in uni, when I... Not when I was at uni, because I never used to go in like the SU and that. The SQ. <laughs> <laughs> I'd, uh, I didn't start like SU life till I started running the gig there. Yeah. Um, but swill would be like when you throw a drink over, like guys would get swilled. Yeah, yeah. I don't know about that. What do you mean? I just, I'd just rather call it throwing a drink over someone. Mm. A light just fell over there. Yeah, man. The light, was, there is a light. <laughs> oh, That's oh my god! It's because it's on a a flimsy tripod. It's not, and we're done with it now. I think. 
Uh, that go. will fall down, I think. It's like a part of the Berlin Wall that's in Ripley's building. <laughs> <or not. laughs> if it goes, it goes. <laughs> it? It's fine. Um, I w- went out on a night out in St. Helens once and was dancing and bumped into a girl and she spilled a drink on herself. Yeah, swilled herself. Swilled herself. Turned round, swilled another lad because she purpose. thought it was him. Oh, no. And I was just like... Oh no, this is so awkward. You can't swill yourself and then it's like going mm, and then punching someone else. Yeah, yeah. like standing on your own shoe. It's like burning. Your, it's like what dogs do when they like chase their tail and they, <laughs> or like they fart in their sleep and they think it's another dog <laughs> and then they get up and like. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> Uh, you can't it's like no, burn, but it wasn't. burning yourself with a fag it was more she thought and then going around burning <laughs> everyone else <laughs> no she thought it, it'd be like if she if she burnt herself because someone knocked into her yeah and then she burnt him for knocking into her but you'd look at, at, at you'd like trajectory and stuff I know I've seen a lot of Dexter and I'm probably on about blood spatter and that <laughs> blood spatter but you'd know where you know, it's, it's blood spatter spatter that's weird isn't it yeah Mm. That is weird. Because a blood... A, it's one of them, like we were saying before about circle and cycle. Yeah. It sort of means the same thing, but it's a totally different word, but it's a very similar word. Yeah, spatter and So splatter. spatter and splatter are the same, but... It's spatter analysis. Yeah. Mm. I think it is. If only is, we had yeah, someone yeah. checking it. Mm. So a spatter is cover with drops or spots of summit. Yes. And then splatter is splash with liquid. Yeah, so it splatters could, when they... Because it's spots of blood in it that they're analysing. But it could be splashes, though. So what you're saying there is if it's if, if you, it goes in a certain way, it's blood splatter, and if it goes in another way, it's spatter. So if it's dots, it's spatter. Yeah. And but you could technically... There would be spatter and splatter. Sounds like some fucking kid's cartoon. <laughs> like Dick and Dom. Yeah, spatter <laughs> and splatter. Um, sep splatter and sep spatter. <laughs> Uh, in a different way, so you could have yeah. both on the same. But is it not the read the splatter thing out again? Splash with liquid, typically a thick or viscous one. Which c- blood could blood, be? Yeah. I've got viscous blood. Yeah, I've got thick blood. It's heavily oxygenated. I've got more red blood cells. That's why I'm not having the AstraZeni. Is it really? I'm g- yeah, I'm going to have. Is you worried about the clots? Um, yeah, blood oh. clots. Blood clots. Bumba clots. I'm worried about. <laughs> <laughs> Um, what is a bumba clot? Is it like a it's toilet paper, isn't it? Is it? Yeah, I thought so. That's what I thought it was, but I wasn't sure. Yeah, and it's a blood like clot, a shitty, like a tampon. Yeah, a shitty a san- sanitary towel. Sanitary. Not a shitty sanitary towel. Sorry, <laughs> yeah, a sanitary it, towel and yeah, a shitty. You put it the wrong paper. way there. Yeah, <laughs> put it on a on, Wipe on back the wrong the front way. There. <laughs> <laughs> is that what happens? You. You asked that. I didn't want to. Um. I forgot what I was saying before we got into the thick blood spatter. No, before spatter and splatter, set splatter. Can't remember what we were saying. Why did we talk about Dexter? Oh no, Ooh, it's gone that one, hasn't it? It's well gone that. It's gone or scone, depending on where you're from. <laughs> well, you were talking about slippers anyway. Yeah, I don't. I don't. Uh, I don't slipper. Yeah. You're a sock or a shoe, man. A sock or a shoe, and no in between. There's mm. no limbo. No. Um. So yeah, I, I have got sliders, mm. but they're for like putting the bins out. Yeah, right. Or, or the you, beach. Or you go, yeah, go to the swimming pool or something. Um, yeah, for the Veruca stopper. Yeah. <sighs> uh, but I'm. I don't want. There's there's a few things in my life that I'm proud of that I've re- resisted mm. and I shouldn't be proud really, but I'm, I'm quite proud of the fact that I've literally, and I don't mean this with any hyperbole. I've never owned slippers. Right. And I want to keep it that way. You know, when you get like, not a, even when you was a kid. Nah. So, you know, when you get a record and like, it doesn't really mean anything, mm. but you just want to keep it going. Yeah. I'm, I can't think of an example, I'm sure, maybe. Like going out and not, not being sick. Yeah. Something like that. One of them is that I've never owned slippers. Because obviously I told you about my record with like never having to buy shoes other than school. Mm. And then my granddad died and fucked that up. Yeah. RIP, not piss. And I'm never going to buy slippers, but I do feel like I need 
like a, a mid ground thing. Mm. So I'm thinking that I'm going to get, well, I was thinking I was going to opt for a croc. Right. I've, the croc is, is much, much derided, the croc. Mm. It's it's almost like it's um, synonymous with giving up. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like when you've got the croc. You just don't care anymore. You've just accepted that you're only going to see your kids yeah. one every, every other weekend. Or like, you you know, you, you normally walk past the, the wranglers in Matalan, but now you've tried them on yeah, and they're quite yeah. comfy. And they do go quite well with the crocs. Yeah, well, yeah, the old <laughs> wrangler crocs. The croc wrangler combo. <laughs> yeah, biggest the, combo since the Steve Steptoe Irwin. and Son. The Steve oh, the Irwin. Steve Irwin. Irwin. Look, yeah, 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 yeah. It's the wrangler and crocs. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if your name was Ray to the chest. <laughs> um... <laughs> R.I.P. R.I.P. Yeah. Um, oh, I know it, we shouldn't laugh at a man's death. I'll laugh at a death. <laughs> all right, I won't. Go on. But of all the things, I know it's quite I hack. Don't fuck with them, though. No, but it's like it's like Lewis Hamilton like dying on his bike. Nah. No, it is. Yeah. Why? No, it is because he Why spent all his time like. Because people swim with stingrays. He's like dealing with these animals. I've touched who one. Who, who swims with stingrays? Mate, loads yeah. of people. I've touched one, and I know I shouldn't, and if you don't evoke my I, membership, I Blue Planet. Planet. <laughs> oh, but I've, I've I touched one on the down low, mate. I touched it here. I touched it there. I touched, show me on <laughs> show me on the soft toy where it touched you. Um, so I'd say it was more like Lewis Hamilton die, dying driving his, his normal car. Well, no, it's not. It's not even that. It's like a. It's a bike. Why? Because this, this, the deadly. Can you Google how many people? Amy, sorry, I, I sounded like. Can you do this now? Uh, how many people die of stingray deaths a year? I'm gonna go over two hundred. I'm gonna say more people die getting killed by people called Ray. Oh, I yeah, think stingrays fair. kill less people than Ray Ban. <laughs> <laughs> Which is ironic because he needed a Ray Ban. Yeah, if he'd have had a Ray Ban, he'd have still been here. <laughs> Sorry, you'd think it'd be at the top of the search, but it's not. No, it's probably teen after what we were searching before. <laughs> yeah. But, like, I don't. I, I just think you've, you're fucking with a dangerous animal. There. It's like Hamilton dying on one of them electric ginger scooters around town. Well, like after doing a hairpin at the Monaco Grand like Prix, like the seg Segway guy. Yeah, but he never diced with anything more difficult. The the point I'm making is like, do you think this thing raised the like if someone the went most pussy so, animal right, he dealt no, with? No, 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 no. What I'm trying to say is, if someone went, hey, do you know Lewis Hamilton's died mm. in a crash? Yeah, you would go F one F one car. Yeah. So if someone went. You you're know, a, you're a one car. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> what's F one car on the on the keyboard? Uh, is that like save the car? Yeah. Um, so, if someone said to you, Steve Irwin's died by an animal. Mm. I think you you would go like it's called the fucking crocodile hunter. Yeah, and I know this is not the the most topical of topics. <laughs> yes, but we're on it now. We're a throwback pod, aren't we? So it just says um, not many. No, well attack. 1,500 per year in US waters alone but the very rarely but that's fatal. a tax though yeah None. exactly non yeah but it's just unfortunately went straight through his heart yeah this is what <laughs> I'm trying to say yeah it's unfortunate mm. and the Ray was to blame mm. you give animals a bad name R.I.P. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, <laughs> What Maybe a guy! A documentary I'll do about him, something. I don't know. Film with his kids are in it. Really? Yeah, because his kids do all the same shit. Oh, Bindi! I don't know. Yeah. Bindi Irwin, yeah. Bindi Irwin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Sounds like what my dad said when I had Dennis Irwin on swap, and I asked what I should do with the other one. Bindi Irwin. Bindi Irwin, there, yeah. lad. <laughs> um, <laughs> what are we talking about again? I don't know. Steve Irwin, now. Crocs. What's funny about Steve Irwin is like. I don't know whether he's called Steve Irwin or Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine if your name was Steve Irwin. Steve Irwin. <laughs> uh, we'd have had on that, wouldn't we? <laughs> so, Crocs. Yeah. 
because I've gone from Crocs to the Crocodile Hunter and then back again. Yeah, yeah. What's mad is that we weren't even talking about Crocs in that capacity, I don't think, when we spoke about Steve Irwin. No. We, we said so about- basically, <laughs> in a roundabout way, I am now becoming the Crocodile Hunter because <laughs> I'm looking for a pair of Crocs, yeah. right? Um, I didn't want to... Oh, yeah, because you mentioned Crocs with the Wranglers, but then you said Steve Irwin, but you weren't. You never even got the Croc, did you? Yeah. Oh, I just Wrangler thought you meant... Because he meant, oh, I just thought you, that was his style. Oh, because he probably loved to wear them. He, yeah. Oh, he, he wore pro- real croc- crocodiles on his feet, I think. No, he never hurt them. You're no, all right, mate. You're no, all right. But, but they die. I always Natural think... Natural causes, um, and then he makes shoes out of them. You know when someone... <laughs> <laughs> this is going to sound horrible. But you know... You know when someone gets, like, in a prison drama, when someone gets, like, attacked in the showers, let's just say? Yeah. Or, like, in their cell. Mm. And the, the way that they talk to the people they're abusing yeah i always thought that that's how steve irwin used to speak to the oh, crocodiles you're all right mate, all right. Shh, you're all right, you're mate. All right. Shh. Yeah, yeah it's okay <laughs> you're all right mate <laughs> yes, just gonna grab you there <laughs> oh feisty one yeah exactly <laughs> oh it's a ripper oh <laughs> uh. I always found uh, that that's how Steve Irwin, you know, sometimes you think you need scissors to open a Kit Kat, but he didn't realise that that's that, that <laughs> corrugated line down the side. And he's like, ah, that's a ripper. All right, sound. <laughs> Cheers, Steve. <laughs> I'll open that with ease. Uh, um, fucking hell. I won't open it with ease. I probably wouldn't open it. I'll be dancing. It's <laughs> <laughs> all good. Appreciate y'all, though. Ripper, Steve Irwin. Oh, yeah. R.I.P. Mm. Rest in peace, peace. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Um, what is his daughter name? Bindi. Yeah, yeah. I knew that. I didn't even need a Google or a, b- a Bingy on that. <laughs> <laughs> so you buying a pair of Crocs? I'm gonna get. A, <laughs> I'm gonna get a pair of Crocs. I'm gutted that I missed out on the. Cr- the you know, because I like carrots as a brand. You know mm. that brand. Um, there was a carrots Crocs collab, collab, yeah. and I oh. missed that. They yeah. were cool. See, Freddie Gibbs has got his own weed now. As Geddy well. Fribs. Yeah, Geddy Fribs has got his own weed. Has he? What's it called? He's got a few. One Alfredo. No, one of them's called like Bunny Sutton. One of them's called like Good Crack or some <laughs> shit like that. Like, for the look, looks good. Going to get some? Can't get it over here. Can you not get it shipped? No, it's illegal here, isn't it? I know, but I thought there were people that, that shipped it. From... You, might, you might get someone who just ends up with some, like, because people get like Cali pots and all shit like that. I know people that have bought it off the internet. There's like an app, I think. Weed apps. Deliver dubs. Uh, told you. Uh, no, but it. um, I think there is. Uh, let me speak to someone. Speak to your people. Speak to my people. Cecil. Cecil peoples. Oh, I hate. I hate the word <laughs> Cecil. That's my least favorite Americanism. That and the gender reveal. Aluminum's my worst one. I oh, think. really? Yeah. Imagine if your name was Al Aluminum. <laughs> Um, and then your British mate's called Al Aluminium. <laughs> <laughs> what about paracetamol? I don't mind as much because the, all the letters are still there. Aluminum, they like, and colour, they spell with no U as well, don't they? Yeah. Just, you can't the, just take the, My least off. favourite Americanism is, is like the Theater. RE, the getting rid of the RE. Yeah, centre and stuff like Meter. that. Meter. Yeah. Theatre. Mm. There's a reason though. There's a reason that the U goes out of colour. I can't remember what it was. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I think it's because they're all just lazy cunts. Yeah. With a U. Um, cons. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. It's the way they say Craig. Craig? Yeah. <laughs> hey, Craig. I hate it. Yeah. And twat. 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 I think twat's its own word now, though. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What will you Google? Twat. Yeah. Please. Um, An American spelling. They changed it as a form of process. Yeah. I thought there was a thing. For what colour? Man? Yeah, because Twat. they're like, this is the Twat. way the Brits Twat. do it. Fuck that. Ah, oh, right, yeah, yeah. But you're speaking English, though. Yeah, just make your own language up. Yeah. Start, start American American if you want. Americanese. Americanese. Yeah. Total waste of time. So so it's not... Oh, it's an it's an acronym. It's not twat, then. No. So it's like, oh, you're a twat, you. You're a total waste of time. Oh, yeah, that's like, the, that's like it, they're trying to soften it up. Yeah, so it's not... It's like the way they don't say... It's like when you try when you're a kid and you you want to say, uh, like sod, 
Yeah. And your mum's like, you can't say sod or and you or, or it's the same when you say, oh, twat is a pregnant fish. Do you remember that one? No, we used no. to try and get away with that. Yeah. So you'd say twat and your mum would be like, what are you saying? And you'd be like, oh no, it's a pregnant fish. Yeah. What's a pregnant, why? I don't know. This is oh, what I'm saying. Or right, like yeah. sod when you say, oh, you cheeky sod. And they'd mm. be like, are you swearing? And you'd be like, no, it's a, it's a, ch or like slag. Slag. Like a slag heap. The rock. Like a, not the rock, not the way in. No, he's Might not a slag. slag. Like, um, back in the day. Um, what was I going to say then? Your heads fell off. Our heads have fell off. It's a brand new experience, all this. Um, That's what for a pregnant goldfish. It says it's never appeared in any respectable no. dictionary. No, but it is like a, it is a thing though. Yeah. Does it say that it? it's like a... It's not... I haven't just made that up. No. Some um, imagine if your name was May that up. <laughs> <laughs> but in America, like they don't even say damn on the... Like, the radio and stuff like that, Damn, do they? Daniel. Like it gets bleeped out on. Well, do you know what? Uh, I should should have said this. I should have said it months ago. But you know our page on Facebook is Damn Daniel with no N. Yeah. Because yeah. they wouldn't let us put it. I know. So shit that. Fucking prick. So stupid. But you know in Australia, they don't prox. They don't um, censor the songs on the radio. On that. Oh, I love that. I think it's just it's just the way it should be. Do you know why? Because we're adults. Like I get it. In the day. Even in the day, no, but they should. Like, no, they probably should in the day. Like I'm, like I'm not mad at that. Yeah. But when I'm listening to like the radio at like one o'clock in the morning, yeah, I want to hear all the and words. Saying like shit backwards and all that. Yeah, it's like, wank. Mm. It's wank. <laughs> um, <laughs> do you know what? Do you know what the similar thing to that is? Because I think if you're le if you're letting your kid listen to that at one, mm. use a bad parent. In the same way that I think all. Uh, parent-child uh, spaces yeah. should be fair game after like 10. Like in the pub? Like when we got shouted at for swearing in the pub? Yeah, but there, there should be a cut off. 11 exactly, yeah. exactly that. Um, do you know what does my head in though with like song censorships and that? When they do like a radio edit and like say that WAP. Yeah. Like every other fucking word and that was bleeped out, wasn't it? It's like, I feel like if you make a song like that, you shouldn't expect it to be played on the radio did you hear what they did with WAP no, no so they changed it to wet and gushy which I think is worse <laughs> yeah. it sounds worse mm. gushy gush but, but it's like <laughs> I think if you write a song like that you should expect it and to I, not you know what? be played on the radio and I think the they radio. do but I think they need because Cardi like, let's take WAP for example um, I think they obviously want to play it because the song's yeah. popular they need to play it But so that's what I mean so should they not just go this is the song. Yeah. They they went really, really mad in like the early aughts, like turn of the century, the early noughties. With Imagine the, if your name was Turner the century. Oh, I like it. <laughs> Jeez. Um, so they, they started not only censoring, they were censoring the videos as well. Yeah. So there was one where it, a woman was like drinking a bottle of champagne mm. like that. Like with the bottle, like vertically. No, it's, it, well, it's not yeah, if yeah. you know it's a bottle of champagne. Yeah, yeah. But because they blurred it out, oh, it, it just looked like it looked worse. It looked like she was just sucking yeah. a fat dick. Yeah, just keep the champagne on, yeah. Yeah. Uh, that's mad. I remember on the. Is it it looked like she had Dom Perignon in a <laughs> Dominic Perignon in her mouth. <laughs> was it Forgot About Dre? I think it is when he says uh, bit like about burning the house down. He's like, I was just playing my Will Smith CDs on that video. Yeah. They like blared out the house on fire and shit on that. Right. And it's just like, like don't play Eminem if you like, I, I just don't get, don't play the tunes if. What is that? What's the lyric? It's like when the, um, ah, what was it? It's because he says like about stood next to the house with a can mm. and a match. Whatever. With a can full of gas and a handful of yeah, matches. Yeah, yeah. I still weren't found out. If it was up but, to me, you motherfuckers would stop looking up to me with your hands out looking. <laughs> but on the video, it stops and there's like a news report. Oh, of yeah. The house burning down. He's like, I was just stood here with yeah. this my Will Smith CD. Yeah, 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 like, yeah, yeah. The house is on fire. There was loads like, of that. With it. That, that, was, that, that was when I was talking about that era. Yeah, yeah. Like Eminem. Some of them, some of them like substitutions. He used to bleep out Bompton on... Yeah, maybe that was to not upset the Crips. Yeah, maybe. But his best mate, Snoop, he was a Crip, wasn't he? Yeah. 
Fair can't enough. win, can you? <laughs> um, yeah, but that era, they were bleeping out everything yeah. and change it. But the changes are so bad. Mm. Hi, kids. Do you like Primus? Primus. Yeah, yeah. What is that? I just drank a fifth of Kool Aid. Dare me to drive? It's in, like, in my head, because I want, like yeah. Spartacus. Like I was talking about, the Primus is like Primus is a band. Yep. Yeah, oh right, Do but it's the also Park the main event on a Gladiator battle card. Oh, is it? Yeah, right. it's like the headline fight yeah, is the Primus. Yeah. I think he's talking about the band. Right. Oh, because that makes sense then. Because then he says nine inch nails. Yeah, that yeah, works. Yeah. Oh, that okay. A, a, a fair dues. It is stupid. It's still. But does he say that though? Um, because that's worse than violence. See me stick nine inch nails for each one, one of my eyelids. eyelids. Yeah, but yeah, Primus done the South Park theme. Oh, that's yeah, cool. Yeah. They do oh, the mad, crazy band like. So, going on to that, this pod is all over the place, and I'm fine. here for it. Oh, I'm yeah. here for a messy yeah. pod. Yeah, yeah. Um, J'adore la messy pod. <laughs> uh, the Lionel, the Lionel pod. Yeah, yeah like a Barcelona pod. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, there was various things that Kenny said. Oh yeah, you could kind of make out what he said sometimes. Yeah, so throughout the series, I think there was like four. The first one was "I like girls with big fat titties." I like girls with big vaginas. Didn't he sing that? Oh, I don't know. But then there was more, and I don't know what they are. So maybe we should find out. But one day, I do remember writing, listening, uh, watching South Park, and every now and then you go, "He definitely said like big fat titties." Then yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, I know what I know what Kenny said. But I that was the biggest reveal I reckon in my lifetime. That was it. Seeing Kenny's face in the movie. Oh, I can't remember it because he died. No, he died on every episode, didn't he? But in the movie, he dies and goes to heaven, and heaven's just like full of boobs. But uh, he, he, he takes his hood off and speaks to them as Kenny. And it uh, was like, right, oh, I don't oh, remember shit. that. Yeah, I love that film. It was great as film, well. That. So uh, that that's my favorite musical. I was just about to say it's arguably yeah. the best musical or Team America. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> That's what we should do, watch along of. Yeah, so, let's do it. You're not allowed back. after your sacrilege. Oh, what? We've watched it now. Yeah, but didn't Amy just say, oh, it was fine? No, she really no. liked it. I oh. said she really liked it. Well, what was it? I'm sure there was something that happened that Amy was just nonplussed about that we thought she was going to like or something. That defo rings a bell. Maybe. But no, we watched we watched the Team America and Amy really enjoyed oh, it. Oh, no, I liked it. Oh, good. Well, yeah, we should watch them. South Park movie was so funny. Yeah, well, we'll put that on the list then, and we'll do a poll. Yeah, I think a, I think a horror film would be good for a watch along. It's got to be a shit one, though. Do you, you know what we could do watch along of? There's a new Conjuring coming out, like Final Desi. Yeah, because I don't, I haven't really seen like the earlier ones. Of them. And we can we can view the. De- oh, we could just do a watch along. Of, I'm sure the YouTube compilation of, of all the, the deaths, deaths yeah. must be twenty minutes long. Yeah. The whole film's We could rank the deaths. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do a little death ranking. So basically, I'm going to buy some Crocs. Yeah. I mean, I've heard the dead comfy, and there's like little nodules in them, isn't it? Like massage your feet in there. Oh, really? What do you name is Noddy Jewels? <laughs> Nodule. I mean, Nodule. Yeah, they've got like, on the insoles, there's like little, so you get like a little foot massage. While you're walking in them and that. If anyone's got Crocs, hit us up and yeah. let, recommend some Crocs. Well, I know I know Jay from our tattoo shop, he's got, he had some, he was rocking some the other day. Rocking some Crocs, crocking some. Crocking some marbled ones, so you go. Did, to be fair, I, I, I looked at them and I was like, sick them. Would you tattoo in them? <laughs> he was tattooing in them. I think they're good for that. Surgeons and that way, Crocs. I, I and don't that, think don't they? they do now. I don't think they're allowed, are they? Oh, I heard on the, on the because because Crocs... The, the stock market for Crocs is... The Croc market? Yeah, it's, it's sky crocketed. <laughs> um, and uh, there, there was a guy who rang up and he was like, I'm, I'm an, oh, it might have been a nurse, actually. Well, I didn't even think they were allowed. And the reason I thought is, not because of comfort issues, as I know a lot of nurses don't like wear sketches, it's the holes that might, like, needles might fall yeah. through. Various sharps. Oh, mm. Yeah, you and, might have like, to throw fluids. bags over the top of them or something. Bag your Croc. Yeah, yeah. Sweet. Steve Irwin's finishing move, <laughs> isn't it? Bag the croc up. Oh, it's normally a croc bag, isn't it? It's a bag made out of a croc. Mm. Um, I, I don't know whether to get, like, real ones, though, or get a, get a pair of alligators. <laughs> I think you'd have to get... If you're going to get crocs, you I, I don't get know, I might ro- rock a pair of caimans. You can't... <laughs> You can't rock a pair of fucking 
Kimono dragons. Yeah, yeah. Kimono dra- Komodo dragons. Kimono dragons. A kimono dragon is a very co- it's a very comfortable yeah. dragon. <laughs> <laughs> it's a dragon that knows it's probably gonna get some pussy. <laughs> it's turned up and the dragon's got a kimono on. You yeah. know it's time. He's like, yeah. sir. <laughs> kimono dragon. That is one that I know is wrong, but I just I will always say kimono dragon. Yeah. You do that with a lot of stuff, don't you? What me? Yeah. Like animus and that. Mm. Yeah, I'm not asked. No, don't care, do you? Not wast. Wast. Put your wear thumb. That's what I used to think it was. We've done that song. Yeah. I'd love to play we that. We also ev- done the Bob the Bill <laughs> version of that song. Oh shit! Oh no, Smurfs. Sorry. Yeah, Smurfs. One it. Smurfs cover. Don't yeah. stop Smurfing. Mm. So we basically what I'm trying to ascertain. Yeah, that's a good word, isn't it? Um, would you think less of me if I rock rocked up in the croc? Nah, I think I'd just keep him um, Don La Maison anyway. Yeah, I didn't even know it was Dan La Maison <laughs> or Don. Uh, Don, Don, Don La Maison Don. works. Yeah. Donald La Maison. <laughs> um, yeah, I probably wouldn't. I wouldn't wear them uh, outside. See, the thing is, like, because it's not news that people see you as a very cool comedian. That is news to me. No, it's not. It is. It is news. But it's you, shoes to me. You've always got like, like, new shoes to come out and shit on and that. And I think if people start seeing you wearing Crocs, you see a lot more. Do you reckon I'm like a tastemaker? Defo. Do you think there'll be like little MCs in Crocs and that? Yeah, be MC Croc. <laughs> if you may, <laughs> yeah, I could jump on it. Maybe we should off get here, some like. DDP Crocs. Little teal bad boys. Well, no, we could get the little because the the good thing about what's selling them to me. The is the little holes for the little badges. I put a Lacoste one in. I maybe. love about Oh, a croc and an alligator on the same foot. What are you saying? Yeah. Snappy. <laughs> 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 that was bad, though. That's all right. That's not funny. Um, it's up and down on this. Yeah, it is. Like the croc market. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you say Bieber bought, some, bought Vicky B some crocs? And that's what's making me think. I don't... Because I didn't now. know they were hype. Yeah. I just was going to get them because I thought they were functional, but now if... Because I've saw the, the... Can we bait Amy out? And yeah. With the, what? The Croc Martins? Yeah. So there's some Croc Martins, isn't there? Yeah. Which are Dr. Martins and Crocs. Half and halves. Yeah. yeah. What did you call them? Doc Crocs. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't doesn't, doesn't work as doesn't well. Work does as well. By the way, Croc Martin... I would watch on ITV instead of Doc Martin. What, what's Doc Martin? Doc Martin, Martin is Martin Clunes. Clunes, but if he was like half crocodile <laughs> going around Cornwall fucking <laughs> eating people. Yeah. Or he's just real life crocodile dentist. Yeah. You know, like he had to go and tend oh, to the... I fell mad. down the stairs playing crocodile dentist once. Did you? Because I wasn't... I didn't used to play the game. Who plays games on the landing? I live on the edge, mate. <laughs> what did you do? Stand on a snake? <laughs> no. <laughs> you had to go all the way down the stairs. No, what it was, the actual game where, you know, he pulled the teeth out and yeah, it come after yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That used to scare me. Right. So I used to just play with the crocodile. like Oh, like it was a toy. Ah, yeah. And I was at the top of the stairs and I was going down the stairs with it. And then I went down the stairs with it. Oh, no. <laughs> you all right? I mean, what would be not. funny? Imagine if, like, you knocked all your teeth, My teeth out. out yeah. yeah, that'd be. My mum tried to. Have... Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> fucking bit your ma, and then she deleted her Patreon again. Um, <laughs> did she sign back up? Yeah, she's been here for ages. Oh uh, yeah, that's shout out. And she man. only went for like a week. Oh, is right. No, she didn't. She was. It was longer than that. She was a few weeks. <laughs> Asha. She was letting the back catalogue build Didn't she have a, She had scheduling issues, didn't she? Yeah, 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 yeah she's yeah, working. That's what it was. Yeah, she's um, busy working. Yeah. <laughs> She's letting a back catalogue build up. Oh, he's right. So she had stuff to catch up on. That's Shout out Ange. Uh, and she said now the Patreon's the best money she's ever spent, right? Yeah, yeah. Proper, like, she said well it's well done. worth it and it's easily the best yeah. three, five, ten, or twenty pounds that yeah, she's yeah. ever spent. And she spent some money on some good stuff. Loads of good stuff. Especially with the new studio, she said, like with the watch alongs and like the beat battles and everything else yeah, that yeah. comes along with that, that having more time and space. Show. She everything. said it's like arguably guests. Guests as well. Guest who? Who? I don't know yet. <laughs> they, haven't booked, they haven't booked them. But, uh, we'll find out soon. <laughs> have some guests on. Joe yeah. Guest. Mm. Your dad's David watching. Guest. David Guest. He's still alive. I know he died on Big Brother and come back to life. <laughs> 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 that was one of the best moments in telly. That. Oh, mate. When she come out going, David's dead. Do you I remember that? I, re- I remember it as an event, but I never saw he it. He was asleep and she come out screaming and going, David's Thing dead. Thing is, man's out going. 
Man's what? had that much Botox. <laughs> you wouldn't know if he was dead or not. Is he dead in real life? I think he I think is. He is now. Yeah. Have a look on that. Be my guest. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 No nonsense, Wait, how, long, how long's he been dead? <laughs> uh, 12th of April 2016. Oh, it was, oh, it was the, not long the, for the death anniversary. Oh, yeah. I hate it when people say anniversary of his death because Anne means born. Yeah. So it just doesn't work. Yeah, unless he died on his birthday. Yeah. Mm, but then still, that's not. Because he died on his you can born, only be day. Bo- Yeah, but you can only be born once unless you're a born again Christian. Yeah, or. or Imagine if your name was Christian Born again. <laughs> <laughs> what was the one of Born Identity? He was, was he like reborn? Didn't they find him in the sea or something? I've never seen it. Oh, I've I. never watched ITV2 at nine <laughs> o'clock every night. <laughs> 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 and when I did, the one time I did, it was the, it was Hot Fuzzy's oh, night. Shaun of the Dead. Yeah. Oh my God. You should just do one of them, watch along. <laughs> the Cornetto the trilogy. ITV, <laughs> ITV yeah, we'll just because we've got to put me fire stick in there, and yeah, so we've yeah. got real telly in there. Now. So once a week we'll have we'll just four identity. <laughs> Basically, we're, we're now goggle box. Yeah, goggle box. <laughs> we'll do that. <laughs> we'll do that. Oh, that's funny, David Guest. That's for you know what he's one of them. You know, there's people that if people didn't bring him up to you, yeah, I don't think I'd have ever. Was he like Michael Jackson's best mate or something? Guest mate. <laughs> he was his mate. It was Liza Minnelli's husband. Oh, okay. At one point, was he a bit of a what's the, a beard? Oh, I don't was know. She a beard? Was she? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. We'll never know now. Well, Liza Minnelli's dead as well, isn't she? Yeah, she died. Took his secret to the grave. Is Liza Minnelli dead? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Let's get another update. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> what, Liza sorry. Minnelli. What are you googling? Here? <laughs> uh, when David Guest was in I'm a Celebrity, and he blagged to everyone that the charity he was raising money for was like an Albino hotel, like an Albino uh, hotel. Albi- yeah, called Albino Heights. Imagine your name is Albino. <laughs> <laughs> I would have called it the White House. Ah. <laughs> uh, I worked in a pub in New Zealand, and the musician they called him Alby. And he was Albino? Yeah, yeah. I thought his name was Albert. Shit. And they were like, no, his name's like Chris. He's <laughs> he's Albino, s- isn't he? He sang like, everything oh, except yeah. James Brown. <laughs> <laughs> Just the white stripes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Fucking, uh, oh, the White Album, who's on that? The Beatles. Yeah, there's loads of that. The, Albe- the Al Beatles. Al Beatles. <laughs> <laughs> She's still alive. What? Liza? Yeah, yeah. Is she As not? If? I thought. Well, I mean, you've got <laughs> Google there. Is Just because I'm shocked doesn't mean I've changed. Active, 1949 till present. Oh no! Someone did a really sick séance and she did some tap dancing the other day. <laughs> Years active. Yeah, she, she's 75. Way. Oh, that's right. not even old in this yeah. day and age. How old was Guesty when he passed? It was about seventy something, I think. How old was his face though? I think his face was thirteen. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> young. Sixty-two. Wow, that's no age. No, that's no age. Though. That is no. Some, I guarantee you'll hear that five times a year. Have you seen all the shit that's going on with for Tom Moore's? Oh. You just won't let him rest in peace, man. Mate, but all this rest in they're peace. They're trying talk. to make him rest in peace. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Dame Judy Dench <laughs> is eating like a hundred Maltesers in thirty seconds to commemorate. She can't even see. <laughs> to commemorate. How's she gonna eat them? <laughs> To commemorate John John Moore's John Moore's yeah. Tom Moore's <laughs> John Moore's was his like brother that wasn't as successful, <laughs> yeah. not as popular. <laughs> People were like, did you get into Tom Moore's? Nah, no, no, John, John Moore's, John mate. For me. I only done fifty laps in the garden. <laughs> <laughs> the did you see that on Twitter that I retweeted, and it was like a, a chippy doing like. To celebrate his birthday. The bean, what was it? A bean a roll? vegan bean roll, like <laughs> one of his Mo- favourites. Mosey loved a vegan <laughs> bean roll. That's what kept him going. He would have only done 70 laps yeah. if it wasn't for the fucking 30 laps yeah. to go the bean fiber. roll. Yeah, fucking hell. Imagine your name was Dean Roll. <laughs> <laughs> what? <sighs> so what Let him. So what are they doing now? They're just doing all sorts of fundraisers. What other stuff? Will you Google uh, Judy Dench... Um, Tom Moore Malteser challenge or something. Yeah, if you've got time, <laughs> it's a big Google that. Ah, that's all right. It's only f- six words. 
A lot of letters, though. What's she doing? What What's other people doing? Is it just Judy? Is she just taking it upon herself to do that? Eats 100 Maltesers as part of... I reckon Moore's she's got challenge. like... Because it was Easter. She's Tom Moore's challenge. Tom Moore. <laughs> is that like the man... It's the same as the mannequin challenge. challenge really. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you just stay still. Oh, you have to do various things. 100 of I'm going to evoke the memory of Tom Moore 100 times. <laughs> is it Moore's or Moore? Captain Tom Moore. Hmm. Um, Give me some more. David Beckham. You people had enough. <laughs> Give me some more. <laughs> Does a hundred keepy uppies. Oh, easy. I mean, um, these are well easier than what he done. Right. Fuck it. A hundred of eating Maltesers is not the Jeez. same as... Cheese. A hundred Maltesers. Cheese. Cheese. Is it for you, Tom Moore? Cheese. <laughs> This is for you, Tom. It's what he would have wanted. Sheeps. Rest in peace, bro. Sheeps. 22. Sheeps. Can someone count for me? Twenty-five. I wish I'd have done this with Amy Winehouse and I finished my life. Sheeps. Sheeps. What are we on? I think this is 39. Sheeps. Sheeps. 40. Yeah, this is for you. Sheeps. 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 Oh my god. Sheeps. 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 Did you say my face at the same time? Look, it is the weekend as well. It's the weekend. Is that the weekend? Yeah. Oh, thank God. Are we for up that. to there? 63 or something? Sheeps. 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 I bet Tom wish you'd have done this instead of walking around yeah, the fucking yeah. garden. Sheeps. Sheeps. What are we on? Sheeps. Oh, it's not that's what he wanted. That's, that's what he would have wanted. That. <laughs> <laughs> that's why he went to Bermuda or whatever he went. One. Sheeps. Sheeps. I'm doing that thing now that when I do press ups, I start breaking it down. So I'm like, I've got 10 threes left. Yeah, so it's a set of five. Sheeps. 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 Fucking hell. Sheeps. Sheeps. Are you that? Sheeps. Sheeps. 10 twos left. Sheeps. 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 90. Sheeps. Sheeps. Has anyone got any Maltesers? Sheeps. 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 We're making love. That one's for you, Big Tom. We'll make it oh, up. No. <laughs> we'll make it up. It's not worth it. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that, tw- that clip's going on Twitter. It's just that. That's our bit for charity <laughs> there. <sighs> Fuck subtitle and that though. Oh, do it! <laughs> Jeez. Times 100. <laughs> Can we do a punditry and go home? Yeah. <laughs> Just I honestly feel like lightheaded. That my my head's hurting and my face was proper hurting. My cheeks were God, oh, mate. My cheeks. cheeks. <laughs> 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 
Oh. El Cabong! I hope it was worth the wait, everyone. Yeah. Do you know what's mad? It probably fucking did was quicker walking around the garden. That took ages. <laughs> took well longer than I thought. It was about three minutes of cheese. It's fucking Wallace and Gromit would have loved it. Oh, fuck me, man. It's not coming for Yeah, I know. Dean. 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 I hope everyone enjoyed that, but uh, I mean, I did, so... I don't, yeah, I don't doesn't, care. Doesn't matter, does skip it? Skip on. Yeah, skip about three minutes of... <laughs> I'll, put a little, I'll put a little time stamp in if you want to sit through it. <laughs> if you're lactose intolerant. <sighs> Need a little punditry drop, don't we? Mm. Oh, I'd never want to hear that again. <laughs> <laughs> did want to get him on the podcast, but I don't think I want him anymore. Oh, no. <laughs> Shout out, uh, Big Sucker Rocky. Anyway, Big Sucker Rocky, yeah. Big Sucker Socky, lad. No following me. Probably already all following. Yeah, he's 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 follow. followers. Yeah, he's more than us. Follow us on Instagram. Yeah, follow us everywhere. Oh. Yeah. Follow us to Ikea after this to get some sick plants. And follow us to the supermarket tomorrow to get some... Um, <laughs> Sign up to a Patreon for our good charity work. We just... Sheesh. Yeah. <laughs> so, under tree. We haven't done one of these for a while, have This we? is your one, this, isn't it? This is your yeah, first I do F. enjoy this one. I don't know what it is. It's called El Cabong, yeah. the most famous heckler comeback of my generation. Yeah, I think he's Australian, the comedian. Right. Uh, El Cabongo. Oh, he might not be, actually. It looks like it's same no, play. He's like, he's, he's like, what, like Southern America. Right. right. It's same play in the corner, like the, all the videos on You've Been Framed did. Yeah. You know, like yeah, it looks VCR like it's filmed one. on a camcorder. Yeah, defo. Hey, ho. What's your name? Kidding, man. What's your name? So. To set the scheme, mm. he's got um, a guitar, yeah. but he's also got one of them uh, harmonicas. Strapped around his neck. Yeah, which is the equivalent of having the sunglasses strapped around your neck and mm. uh, sock braces in my head. I, I disagree there. Okay. Because the sunglasses around your neck is just so you don't lose them, in it? Mm. The harmonica around your neck is so you don't have to hold it. Oh right! You I play it, it while so you're, you're playing guitar. Ah, uh, but also it it serves as it, yeah, it you can't lose it as yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. It'd be weird if you did. You just always oh, it gone. Has it gone? <laughs> 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 Your dad can only play "God Save the Queen" on his. He calls it the Da Monica. <laughs> <laughs> Your dad says he fancies Monica from Friends, but not in the old ones where she's fat. <laughs> Shit, so. Someone's called him an asshole already. Yeah, if you guys don't shut the fuck up, about 200 people are going to beat the living shit out of you. Know? I wow. So he's dealing with it. I think they might have been a bit rowdy all night this Throughout group. the show. So he says, you know, if you don't shut up, all this whole crowd's going to batter you. Mm. That, uh, don't, don't, really speak, don't speak for me. No. I'm not going to batter anyone, yeah, El Cabong. Yeah. I'm going to chill. I'm going to mm. stay be seated. Some of them sound like they might want to battle Because we got people can just take you out of here so fast, man. It'll be like you out in the parking lot going, huh? I will say. That was a bad joke as well. I hate this man. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's not a cool guy. My favourite thing, before we go any further, is after the event happens, the energy in the room goes from like sky high to absolute zero. Right. That's my favourite thing about it. Okay. So just listen out for that. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, stay. I seen your license plate. Oklahoma's okay. It's like, you know, it might not be Nirvana, man, but by God, it's okay. <laughs> I don't know if you're in Oklahoma. Regional you're jokes. Oklahoma. I hate this Regional man jokes. so much. Yeah. Like, if I ever saw him in the street, I'd pretend to shake his hand and move it away. <laughs> and be like, ah, fish nah, yeah, fish off. Fish, fish off, off lad. You know, I guess if you were gay, you'd be in Oklahoma. Kind of like this guy. Wow, a little homophobic little slur homophobic, there. A little homophobic one, yeah. Do you know? No, really, don't mess with me, because I don't come down to the bus station and slap the dick out of your mouth when you're... Oh, El Cabongo! Oh, 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 o
with the classic heckle Classic down. comebacks. I don't come down to wherever you go and slap the whatever's out of yeah, your yeah, mouth. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck off. Dealing well with the hecklers. He... Imagine if it was <laughs> Neil or no Neil. <laughs> Fellas coming. So someone walks up. So the guy, the guy who's been heckling, comes up, up to him. Yeah, yeah. And he swings, and he goes, "Come on, then." And like, if you you can, he hits him with the guitar. And you can actually, if you listen, listen to the energy. No, but listen to the guitar noise. No. Listen to the crowd now, though. Mate, he's the only comedian ever to hit a man with his best joke. <laughs> <laughs> like he's, he's, that's his only act, his guitar. Yeah. Obviously, he's not a funny man. Yeah, yeah. So if you go, like, <laughs> the crowd's all whooping and cheering as he's getting up because they think it might be a bit Bante. of a... But yeah. And then he twats him with the guitar and they go, oh, Ooh, no. whoa. But then listen to what he says now. It's my favourite part. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. The guy fucking came at me. What do you think, folks? <laughs> oh, sorry. I was laughing because he's he making it sound like he... This is the best bit, though. He goes, the guy just come right at me, and he goes, what do you think, folks? Like, Right, okay. But he, the way he said he came at me, it was like he's a fucking lion or something. Oh, like he, did, he, he didn't say, come up here. It's like a pissed up guy in, a, in him, a gig. Come, come up here, then, motherfucker. And he's like, whoa, he came at me like he was going to stab him yeah. and that. And he's like, oh, he, he is coming up at me. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. The guy fucking came at me. What do you think, folks? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. It's not even a no. Even it's like a no. no. Oh, no. It's Alan's dog. Okay, show. Okay, show's over. <laughs> Just gets off. Oh, that was... <laughs> Mate, you can't get heckled with factual... That's factual quips. <laughs> that was unnecessary, sir. Yeah. Moved it out, Where did you see that? It was like one of the first ever YouTube videos I've seen. <laughs> like Is it? years and years ago I seen it. There's like a minute left. I don't I don't really know what happens in the next minute. I want my money back! <laughs> see What do you think, folks? No. If I paid to watch him. That's what I'd want him to do. I'd want him to do that than do his fucking shit comedy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was the best his thing homophobic, that. shitty yeah. jokes. Best thing he'd done. I'd want to see him hit a man who came at him. Yeah, yeah. It does me a thing and he goes, come on then. And then he comes and he goes, uh, come right at me. <laughs> yeah, it's one of them. I've got a joke. You've heard my joke yeah, when I say, yeah, yeah. like, have you ever said, come on then? And then be scared when they actually they do actually come on come then. then. <laughs> That's what's <laughs> happened there. <laughs> Just a tumult now. There's comedy. So coming as per that, the heckler is gonna be flat. <laughs> Someone's what step one, audience cheers for action. Step two, comedian takes action. Results, audience disapproves of comedian's <laughs> actions. <laughs> Someone's just like transcribed it. The guy came at me, what do you think, folks? No. No. All right, show's over. <laughs> He didn't even argue, did he? He went, what do you think, folks? They yeah. were like, like no. Oh, and he was like, yeah, I've fair. I've lost these, yeah. Fair. I'm not getting these back. <laughs> Someone's put, good job he didn't play an electric guitar. <laughs> 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 oh, fucking hell. It's funny, that one. Oh, that's funny. I'm just seeing what the... Uh... Someone's put, I want my money back. He's put, shit, that's getting your money's worth right there. Yeah. Yeah, you d you definitely leave the gig with something to talk about, won't yeah. you? Like, oh my god, that's the thing. What I've always found about when you go see someone, 
you leave going, oh, he's dead funny. What was that thing he said? Oh, I can't remember, but he said something dead funny. <laughs> but you go, he fucking twatted them with his guitar. It was amazing. <laughs> Loads of people in the comments are just writing, I want my money back. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, folks? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> um, well, you, you'll put a link to that, I imagine. That'll yeah, be, yeah, yeah. be a little link. It's a... Uh, it's El Cabong, the most famous heckler comeback of my generation. Yeah. What's mad, though, is that he he did the most famous heckler comeback of all time, which is the shit one about I don't come to come your to job your and sp- whatever. spark your dad's cock out yeah, your mouth, yeah. moot, or whatever it was. Um, what do you think, folks? No. no. <laughs> <laughs> That's up there with the Friday, no, that. Oh, no. Nope. Oh, was that on the... That's was that surprise, the Oh! Cabongo. Yeah. Um, I'm going no. now. I've got an headache and I want to go to Ikea. Yeah. I don't know if you want to come. Um, going to Ikea now. Uh, thanks for listening. Amy, thank you for Googling. You've done a cracking job. Thanks. It's yeah. always nice to see you. Um, it's nice to see you uh, like less like melted into the couch like you were last time I saw <laughs> uh, you. It was too much. <laughs> it was hilarious when we got home and you went... I don't even know what what happened in that film. <laughs> I couldn't follow it as well. I mean, it's hardly like the most complex. Yeah. It's just one day, isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> it's literally, literally one day. Not even the full day either. No, like it's from like 12 not, hours nine to eight. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> if you want to know what we're on about. Uh, we got a watch on along uh, on the Patreon where we just all watch Friday. We're going to be doing a lot of them. Um, this isn't an official hashtag ad Patreon wise, but... Um, we are going to be upping the levs on there now, and upping the content, and yeah. upping the the pro- what what was it the content? No, what I, I'm I'm looking at a specific word. Yeah. Uh, production levels. No, yeah. it's not that. It doesn't matter. Stuff's up. We're going to be making there. more stuff. Yeah. Um. So, and if anyone says they want their money back, I will say no. Uh, no, no. <laughs> so do join us on there uh shout out to the two people that help this show the two companies that help this show uh chu gummies they do pre-workout gummies and they've just dropped the protein gummy as well if you're a gym going type or you like to exercise i've lost over a stone man's lost 16 pound on the gummies you're running you know on your runs, absolutely you? flying 10 gummies face tingles go for a run Ooh. that's what you do um, well, you know they're kicking in yeah, it's cool. Yeah, face. you get a tingly face. It's apparently it's the beta al- tingly face. Yeah, it's the beta <laughs> alanine. Oh. His name is alanine. Alanine. Um so yeah, they're fucking brilliant. Uh DDP ten, all caps for them. I would recommend them. And also, uh forty five barbecues are doing some absolutely cracking stuff. Go on their Instagram and see what they're up to. They're doing like ready steady cook challenges and mm. shit like that. Yeah. Barbecue offs. If you're into meat, it's it's a must. Imagine your name is Barbara Q off. <laughs> <laughs> we need, these haven't it's been our best day. ones today. <laughs> um but yeah, see what they're doing on there. They they do not just that, not just barbecues, they make bespoke furniture for you for for you if you want as well. They'll do anything basically. Anything that can mm. be made out of a forty five gallon drum, they will do it. Also, they sell sauces and rubs. So if you've already got a barbecue, go and get some charcoal, go and get some sauces and stuff. Use DDP ten. Uh, get you 10% off, off the whole range. Same with Chew Gummies as well. You get it off on the pre-workout and the protein. Uh, shout out to friends of the show, Crave Bakes as well. Mm-hmm. They, they're not, they've they not asked me to do that. but uh, Garden Social. Oh, shout out Garden Social as well. Um, Holly and Ewan there uh, doing some amazing things. If you're ever in Chester, hit me up because I've got a full list of businesses that you should go and support. Yeah. Um, but I know we've got a far-reaching listenership so we can't just it's not a chester pod really mm. i just mean it was chester pod <laughs> um so yeah i'll see you on on the next one dean will be here amy might be here we don't know uh if she if she wants she's more than welcome so thanks for what oh we didn't intro the pod what what episode was it 34 Jeez. Uh, intro the pod Jeez. now it's our longest one yet <laughs> oh shit <laughs> welcome to the Oh, welcome to the episode 34. Danny's here, Dean's here, Hello. Amy's here on the Google Things. We're at the studio. That's where oh. we're at. Um, not only is it the longest intro, but the shortest pod ever, because yeah, now yeah. I'm going, thanks for listening. <laughs> Baked potato. Daniel 
but that's what you've been listening to. Sign up to the Patreon. Go and get some gummies. Go and get a fucking barbecue or some charcoal and that. Go and get a coffee from Garden Social if you're about and a taco from DBT. We're going to IKEA to get some rugs. Appreciate y'all. It's all good. Appreciate y'all though. Clap if you got half an eyelash. That's my favorite. Yeah, it's a good one. Take care, guys. Bye. See bye. 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 Oh, we. Oh, I was gonna say we play a tune, but can't be asked. Bye. Bye. <laughs>